Yo, not. Oh, sorry. Uh, not Kenny. Yo, Gloop. Good to see you, brother. How are you doing, bros? My man, Brace. I'm doing pretty good, Gloop. Thank you for asking. Dark Blitz, all right. Paco, you. Giyu. Lucidus, Utipa, Rice. L to Army, my boss, man. Not Kenny. You are first, yes, sir. Kashashmiri, welcome. There's already three modes. Goats. Yo, T. Gu Tigwai Peter Ace Dreadmark Yo Ki Varns Did I play Clash? No, I did not. I haven't really touched League this weekend. Yesterday evening I played one game on my main account. Look, it was a banger. Yesterday I went for dinner with my friends to still celebrate my birthday because I was uh, like I was very weak last weekend and I had a few drinks and I played one game. <laughs> this is how it went. I saw Lickle Darius three times before at level like, at level six he was already zero three. He just started roaming. And my entire team was running, running it. I was 60 to 2 and I lost. It was one of the craziest shit. But I couldn't even be mad. I was like, yeah, whatever. I didn't have high expectations for the game. It was a banger. Yo, Dazuki. Yo, news flash. Uh, I play first strike because I've been playing the Kerberos setup for Yordic, but this week we'll get coached by Slug Dogs, and he also mentioned going Conqueror and or Hail of Blades, so we'll for sure learn more styles of Yordic along the way, but for now I'm gonna go with, uh, with the Yordic Gaming. How wholesome is it that my friend can just buy a fresh account and get placed Platinum 4 by going 0-5 in placement with his actual pick being Bronze 2? Yeah, that is a banger. Yo, it's Fonzo, welcome. No, Paco, you not yet. Sorry. Uh, I am gonna add new content, but in terms of updating, I've been very... I I, I would say lazy. Uh, it's a mix of just being... Uh, you know, life. Life, let's put it that way. But I will get to it, 100%. Alright, let's go. All right. We're still on Emerald Elo. Emerald 1, though. This guy has no... Good, wait, they all don't have mastery. What? No mastery points, no mastery points, no mastery points, no mastery points. Wait, mine is also unlocked. I got Speedboat Larry with the Ezreal jungle You're as well. What's oh, hell no, on? brother. Anyway, how are you <laughs> doing, Alois? Yo, come in. Thank you for the 15, bro. Thank you for the tier 1. I'm doing pretty good. And yes, we are playing Yorikos. Hard matchup here. After level 6, it becomes a little bit more bearable. Yo, Ig Tiny Alex. Good to see you, boss. Yo, Yinx. Thank you, it's Fonzo. Appreciate it, brother. Yorick, nah, you're a pig. My bad, bro. At least say piggy. Pig is too, pig is too offensive, bro. Pig is too, like, too hard. Can you, can you say piggy? Yo, Stacks Addiction. I'm not sure when we do NASA's. Why is my music not going? Oh, it's going. We're good. I don't know how good Speedboat Larry is on the Ezreal jungle, but we're gonna find out. So, uh, yeah, there's that. I uh, think it's a little softer. Yo, Shroti, I'm doing good. What's my opinion on Quinn? If you want my opinion on any champion, I would recommend just watching my tier list. For some reason, it feels like my champion is not per side offset. Like, look how... How is this the bottom? How is this the top? My, my camera set is weird. I don't know how to fix it. It's not per shot offset. This is fixed offset. Ah, maybe it is correct. I don't know. It feels a little bit weird. Yo, Street Jimmy, good to see you, brother. Uh, we're probably rushing Eclipse, right? Okay, let's go. Alright. Gwen isn't the strongest level 1 champion, so we can look to contest a little bit, especially if she's like leashing. I don't see her, she's playing Ghost TP. I'm just gonna start hitting the wave. Because she's not here, right? If I can look for priority, I will look for it. 
If I get level 2, even though this is a realistically hard matchup, I can still be in a fine position. We got two graves here. She's playing D ring. And Ezreal jungle against Lee Sin jungle. I got three goose here. Okay, she's playing bone plating. One melee here, I got my level 2. Nice. So it's a good poke. I want to do second wave crash here, or at least get close. Alright, she's level 2. I need 2 melees for level 3. She's gonna want to kill me now, right? So I'm gonna E her and this, okay? Now we're level 3. I do think I'll select W. It's hard for her to fight me here because the wave is so large. Definitely works in my favor. 70 out of 19 is pretty good. We get a third wave crash. We could up to recall, but I don't think I have to because the always gonna start bouncing back into me. Meaning I'm not forced to walk up for last hits and we can just play here pretty chill. Right? I'm not gonna be forced to walk up for last hits at any given point. Especially if this means walking to the third range because then it's gonna bounce even faster. This is fine. Like I said, the wave is pushing into me, right? Even though it doesn't look like it, those wave is actually kind of hard pushing towards me. Because what's happening is, these three minions of her are going to stay alive. And in the meantime, a new wave comes, right? So she's going to have nine minions now, and I'm going to have six. So even though, even though it doesn't look like it, this wave is actually hard pushing towards me. And again, I'm not forced to walk up for last hits. Should be hard for them to dive me, because Lucy was both sides. So I feel pretty chill here, and I can just keep farming. And then what I'll do is I'll just collect, and then I'll base TP probably to play out the bounce. So I know I have to play out the bounce eventually to set up my reset again, but I have TP, right, so I can get, like, one cheater Rico in. This is gonna be pretty tricky to farm. I think I have to E this. Q that. Oh, I couldn't get that one, but I get this one. That's decent. I'm gonna ward here to see if I can maybe cancel her base. Q for the healing. Mm, I'm gonna refrain from using my potion. Yeah, she can't dive me, we're completely fine, and like I said, Lee Sin is dead, she's not, he's not here, so, not scared. Should've maybe kept my Q for the cannon. I mean, that just sucks. I do have four stacks, I'm waiting a little bit. I'm gonna spot it now, I'll use one biscuit, and it's gonna help me push out the bounce here. She has no potions left. She doesn't know that I see her, I'm waiting for my first strike. On next wave, I'll hit level 6 exactly, chat. Because at 5.50, or at the wave at minute 5, if you've not missed any XP, get you level 6. She could still be here. There she is. And I'm just gonna get my reset in. That hit would be nice, but it's not required. Let's hard focus on the wave now. Like I said, from this wave, I will hit my level 6 because I have not lost any XP. So if I get gank here, I'm fine because of my ult. There we go, level 6. I can recall though, I don't think I should be looking to diving here. Maybe I could, but I'm not comfortable enough on my champion. And also, by instant recalling, I'll be back faster. I can buy pickaxe longsword and we're in a good position. Good day, kind stranger. Good day to you as well. I have not tried Conqueror or Hello Blades yet, but we will try it with... Um... Oh, she's ulting for the wave. Inventive way to try and get her own reset in, but... I'm not gonna make it easy. I'm gonna freeze the wave here somewhat. Every time something dies, a new little piggy spawns. Try and cancel her reset. Alright, she's gonna have to TP as well. She has no ult now. I'm doing alright, Bartley. Thank you for asking. This Ezreal Joe is absolutely smurfing it, so... Speedboat Larry on the Ezreal Jungle has definitely been cooking. If this E lands, it's amazing, because I get a lot of first strike gold, right? There's two graves here to use, but I need my Q on cooldown before I could spawn it. And I need a third, of course. If I land this E, oh, the two would have spawned, but it's okay. She has refillable, and there's a plant in the river that I should be wary of right now. Let's fall back, Maiden. She has no ult, though, so realistically, I am stronger here. That's amazing. Really good chunk. And I'm also going to prioritize going for the plant in the river so that she can't. 
right? Because right now she's pretty low HP. She would want to fight the free sustain that way, but I'm walking like this. Oh, the listen is here, but she he shouldn't be level six, yeah. Okay, it's decent. I don't have to be scared of Lee Sin now. This guy has no potions left. He's half HP. I should just play for... Yo, teammate. Thank you for tier 1. I should just play to try and drain her HP more. She's gonna have ult, so she could look to all in, but I do have my ult still as well, right? And we're in an amazing position now. I just want to hold this position. Landing 1E e would be massive. Get her bone plating. Maybe get her W as well. Oh, well... Wait, what? Oh, wait. The, the, the small Gru's probably got her bone plating. I can spawn three new homies here. Wait, oh, there's three greys. Why can I not spawn it? That would have been a nice hit. Still decent. Need to make sure the maiden doesn't die, so I'm gonna kite her away here. I got two greys still laying here. Three month piggy alloys and alloink alloys and alloink. Who is Sonotan? Take you to the T1, take you to the 3. Make Zoo, take you to the Prime. There we go. Will you do coaching again soon? Yo, yo, Tizer, thank you for the 18, boss man. No, that was the sexiest. Yo, Tizer, what's up, bro? My man, Tizer, thank you for the support, brother. All right, I can maybe dive her. I don't think Alta Q is enough. Nah, she's hitting level eight as well. Yeah, that's what I was scared of. Will I do coaching again soon for the foreseeable future? No, I'm sorry, I'm not into doing solo coaching for the foreseeable future because I still feel a little bit overworked. You're now at 420. Thank you, Tyson, for your extreme generosity, brother. As always, it's amazing to see you. It's amazing to see you all here. And thank you all for the subs. And let me focus here. Yeah, I want to dive this piggy. Okay, I did no damage. Thank you, wife, for sucking it out of her. Okay, decent. Pretty good. I just think we were we have always been in a good position in this matchup because of my first recall and how I got the, the bounce in. We were never in a bad position in this matchup. Our farm is amazing, which is usually a thing I struggle with on Yorick as well, so I can I can sneak in one more plate, listen as both sides, Gwen has no TP. Oh, there we go. Oh, there is an Ari. Goodbye, wife. Unlucky. Alright. We get our eclipse. Okay. Um Did I miss something in chat? A double long sword. I'll get a blue ward. Okay, let me read. Um, so first things first, Tyson. Again, thank you for the 18 extreme generosity for 20 subs, my boss. And regarding the solo coaching, I am not going to be doing any. Oh, no plate. I am not going to be doing any solo coaching for the foreseeable future. Uh, maybe at the end of this month or the month after that, I'd be open to it. But for the time being, no, no solo coaching. I still need to. Schedule my day to the life a lot better before I want to start getting back into solo coaching. Um, but that's mainly it. Yo, I'm good to see you, boss. Yo, and I need good to see you, brother. Um, but yes, eventually I will do solo coaching again. Uh, I still have to work on both courses as well. There is uh, extra content. Oh, I wanted to cute get on this extra content I want to make on those, and I still wanted to make a Riven matchup course. So. That's going to be the priority, and then I'll do solo coaching again. <coughs> this almost one shot, sir, I think. Half red HP chat. Ain't that just crazy? Well, she's back to full HP as well. Hey, if I lose Lance is easy, you know it's gonna be a good day. Wait, Stanoi, can you repeat that message in a second? I can't read it. Yes, I will bring back coaching eventually, bro. Stanoi, repeat that How message a little bit later. How are you feeling today, King Piggy? Yo. <laughs> I'm feeling alright. Thank you for asking, brother. Thank you, Eros, for the primer. I'm feeling pretty good. That guy is good. I am dead. Eros, no this is your fault. No way is Also, minus one. WAIT! Eclipse. I'm the best Yorick in the world! By far! That W was 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 crisp! The rest was crisp! Alexis! Why are they both gonna be a piggy? You guys are the biggest pigs in the- oh. GG, I got the counter too. 
GG. GG. I'm kind of surprised I won there. The W on the ground was crazy. The Q healing on the R was good. And we won. Um, What was I saying, though? Because I forgot my chain of thoughts. You were both going to be piggies, but you are both piggies yourself. That's the first. But you guys already knew that. Uh, I saw something about the second Q cast. Chat, you're going to have to uh, tell me after the game what that was about exactly. Because I didn't understand. What is that guy doing? All right, give me the money. Ah! One more step the end. Wait, does your second Q make your goose follow you? Follow me, follow me, follow me. They're not following. Are oh, the grown boss spawned yet? Yet the gro I'm mildly upset at my own gameplay at the moment currently, but it's all right. Okay, let me focus now. Pro tip on Yorick, never use your second Q. It makes the goose just run around and do nothing. Instead, try to use E. You use your second Q only when enemy laid are not in lane, so you can push, but don't use your Q when pushing with enemy laden in case if the goose die, you don't have to damage your trade and you lose trades easily. Okay, that kind of makes sense. But I feel like I'm not using it that often, no. Like, I'll do it if I need to push the wave. I'll just spawn my goose if I need to push the wave. Like, at level 2. But I don't think I do it too often. I wasted my, my wife now, too. Unlucky. It's alright, though. Um, okay, then, thank you for all the subs, Iras and Alexis. Thank you for the primers, too. For the primer and the tier 1. You guys are both pickies yourself. But here, like, here I'll just use my second Q, no? Like, here, it, it makes sense to spawn my second Q. I'll let the pickies follow me. And then I'm gonna angle my E like it hits both. And now they're gonna do this shit for me. The Isles remember. Did they give me the money? And yeah, I just respawned them so they're full HP again. <laughs> I can do Harold solo very easily, by the way, chat. It's one of the great benefits of playing Yorick. But I do need my piggies to stay alive. Alright, piggies, 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 go do this. Shit. Alright, I need... I mean, I can always use my ult for the Herald, it's alright. My Ezra Jungle is full 1v9, so it's kind of a weird game. I got three piggies here. But here I will spawn them, because else they're too far out of range for my E as well. I feel like I kind of understand how to use my Q2. Unless I'm deluded. Will they jump? I was like, oh, I should have flushed Q'd. No, no, no. I'm Yorick. My wife will suck the life out of her second time. Very nice. Very good. And uh, let's push this out and go for Herald. Is there a way to make the goose follow me after the wave like this? Like, can I make this goose follow me? Come, come, come. Why is only two follow me, for example? I should have flashed. I should have flashed. My damage is still crazy, though. You're like Loki OP at the counter pick, yeah, but Gwench is realistically a hard matchup. You can solo bear with level 3 old, you can even solo bear with level 2 old. If you have four little bros. Alright. I mean, my entire team is absolutely smurfing, so the game is very good. Thank you for the hype train, guys, I appreciate it. Thank you for all the subs once again. It was a little bit hard for me to multitask on reading chat and. Uh, playing the game, but I think we've done an alright job. And thank you for all the uh, support, guys. If they start hitting a wave, they will split push until... The LSU you see to make them do something else. The best is to have w four grades ready for pose... Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. Yes, Irelia and Jax are one of the hardest counters, I know that. I should be bought. This guy should not be bought. 
Because it's Speedboat Larry. Speedboat Larry is just very good on Azure Jungle, I suppose. I need a little bro so I can farm some camps here, I guess. This should spawn a bro. The reason I want Alois to say is because he's small and people take him seriously. I don't have little bros, so I can't remember to Yes, sir. Fantamentos. Thank you, bro. Okay, that's all. Here I'll spawn a second. Third. Fourth. And farm this for me. Okay, never mind. I got old as well. I want to be bolt. I want to split push. I don't want to group my team. If these spawn... Okay, can they do dragon for me? They probably can. Who can counter Yorick Alois? Uh, Aurelia is very good. Jax is very good. Um... I think some range champions can do pretty good if they're like efficient on playing them. Look how fast I do the dragon, by the way. That is just... It's, I think they need to nerf how much... How little damage these ghouls take. I don't even think they needed my help. And this is only three. I could have four as well. It's just crazy. Because I think it is unbalanced how little damage jungle camps and or like neutral monsters do to my ghouls. Like one auto attack from a turret or a champion kills it, but... Every jungle, like, they will kill the jungle camp before it kills them. Like, watch this. If I spawn them on the golems... Oh, there's no golems. All that I can show you. I just think the goose tankiness is, is absurd. To neutral monsters. Okay, so now I would eat to a rest, right? Because I only have two. Okay, now I have three, though. So now all three will spawn. I could also all to spawn them again, but I don't think it's worth it here. Can we get this? I mean, we can keep going here. Oh, that's my bad. Weird. It's fine to take the inhibitor before minute 20 because it is going to be extremely free for us to push the Baron a a afterwards. So an important distinction to make here is very often, I would say it's not worth it to get inips before minute 20, right? Because you are kind of put yourself on a timer because you don't get resources in one lane anymore. But if you can guaranteed get the Nash still, then it's fine. I'm gonna W there and lock them both in. We're still kind of chilling here. I somehow sucked out the Kai'Sa. I don't know what happened. I'll take it. This game is a mess. Absolute mess. I used my ult so I can't do Baron now. Bit of 20 myself though. And now it means Netherlands. Yo, uh, Lord, it's Emerald 1 right now. But yes, if you want to counterpick Yorick, you go Aurelia or Jax. Those are realistically the best. Anything that can jump onto Yorick is very good. Today also made account probably a few games, yes. Still sick? No. I do still have a cough and a little bit of uh, build-up slime, you'd call it. I don't know. But uh, in terms of sickness, I, I'm not sick anymore. I have good energy again. Isn't R Yes, Riven is good into Yorick. Uh, unless you don't do anything pre-6. I don't know how many accounts I have, bro. I I, I lost track a long time ago. Alright. Uh, like I said, it's minute 20. We have two in hip, so we shouldn't give the enemies time to free farm. So it's best for us to start doing the Nasher. Because they're going to be farming bot lane and top lane, right, with the inips. But our means take care of their means, so we are not gaining resources in two side lanes, right? Because our means are killing theirs. So here, we just lose all the means. And that means when you have inhibitors, you don't really gain resources in side lane. That is, again, why I would usually refrain from taking these inhibs early in the game. Because you kind of shoot yourself in the food, unless you can do Nasher for free like we can this game. Then it's completely fine. Because now we can just go 5 mid and it's very free. And if an enemy team wanted to contest, we just kill them all. Alright, what I can do as well, chat, is spawn the Maiden in the sideline. If you don't know how it works, is what you can do with Yorick is you can ult, and then you can see in 9 seconds I can ult again. And basically, when you recast your ult, you free the Maiden, and you lock her to the sideline. So, I'm going to ult here. She's going to keep going to the sideline, and I'm going to TP bolt, and I play both of the sidelines once. I gotta be careful, though, because Gwen could maybe 1v1 without my wife. 
But I can always buff these minions and just play like that. I got three go homies with me though. Never mind, I got four. Like I said, Meta is pushing top, I'm pushing bot. And Maiden's gonna be hitting top lane for me now. Look at the Maiden. She's doing top lane things. Maiden is split pushing for us, bros. Do not touch my wife. Alright. All good. Our team was amazing this game, so it was a very easy game to play. I do want the plus 50. Oh, shit. Well, that died fast. Oh, wait, they FF'd. No, they FF'd. <coughs> GG. Good first game. <coughs> How's your weekend been, by the way, guys? Yo, it's Larson. Good to see you, brother. How's your weekend been, bros? <laughs> Reaching mass is not that hard as long as you have good MMR. Alright, then get masters, bro. Speedboat Larry gets it. Ah, I have two coffees. We're 17 and 1 on this account, by the way. I did not expect to be that good or, or to do that well on Yorick. I understand that I'm, of course, playing in Smurf MMR, but uh, the thing is with Yorick is I have genuinely never played this champion before starting this challenge. The, like, do you guys remember this Yorick? This iteration of Yorick? Old Yorick. This is the only Yorick that, that that I've played before. Uh, like, this this is the only Yorick that I've played before. Basically, you had some weird goose. One would, like, heal you. One would, like, slow or something. This is old Yorick. Yeah, you could spawn, like, random ghouls. Yo, Felix, good to see you, bro. Thank you for the 100. You, yeah, you just spawned this goo. This is Yorick I played. This was broken. That isn't a broken ability. Look, look at this shit, bro. That, 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 that is a crazy old ultimate, by the way. <laughs> so, I don't, this is the Yorick that I played. Now, I didn't play this game a lot. No coincidence. Uh, when I was younger. Because the thing is, I am 23 years old now recently. And I've been playing League of Legends since, like, the end of Season 3-ish. So, I was like... 10 years old when I started playing this game, 10, 11 years old, and I played the game very on and off, especially like in the old days, right? Uh, I didn't have my own laptop or computer, I played at friends or like at, at certain things, but I do remember playing the old Jorik, wait, what? Playing the old Jorik a little bit, and then I never touched his champion again, so yeah, there's that. But I like the champion a lot, the thing is... Yorick is so unique to any other champion. The thing is, every champion is unique in its own way, shape, or form, right? Every champion has their own benefits, their own downsides. But it is kind of surreal to me how... Um... Different Yorick is compared to other champions. I would put it that way. You look 27 or more. That's just because of the beard, bro. I'm getting it shaved Wednesday. You're only champion because you're lucky and have good MMR. I watch like bronze because Ryder purposely keeping me in bronze. I, yeah, 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 but the thing is, if you'd get the same teammates that I get every game, you'd probably be challenger as well. True. 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 Your nearest HJR. I'm doing amazing. Don't shave. No, I'm not shaving. Sorry, I'm getting it, um, how do you call it? Trimmed. I'm getting my beard trimmed on Wednesday. Every three weeks, I go to the barber. I've been doing this for a few months now. In the past, I was never aware that there is a thing called a barber. I just used to go to saloons, or salons, or whatever you call it. Um, but, uh, I have, um, I go to a barber now every three weeks and it's been absolutely amazing. Does my hair, trims the beard and then the three weeks I do it again. So, yeah. I won't full shave it, but I do get it trimmed. I like it a lot that way.
True. I can afford the barber now. That that is unironically true as well, because you guys have all blessed me in this position. Get a trimmer and do it yourself. I would want to learn it, but this guy, the the barber I go to, does such a good job that I feel like, you know, going to a barber is like having makeup, but then for a man. Does that make sense? I hope it makes sense. Oh, Yorick against Renekton. I am not sure. Early game, it should be pretty hard. <coughs> Are you dreading eventually having to do Unrated Mass on Nessus? No. I actually love Nessus as a champion. In fact, I've played him in competitive before as well. I'll showcase you guys what I mean. So, if you guys ever want to search information on my professional career, you can go to gold.gg. Let me search in Alois now. I can show you that I've actually played Nasus before. There was other games when I was still in Dutch League, but they don't show in, in on here. But in my first Prime League season, look, I even played a game with Nasus. Yeah, I, I, I got I, I, my team wasn't optimal. I'll put it that way. But look, I was smurfing at this game, bro. I was smurfing it. Look, old items, everything. This was a grim season or uh, split. Okay, we we definitely did not do well. Uh, I won't go into details on why this uh, sh this split was so horrific, but there was a lot of stuff going on. Okay, but we played a game of Nasus into Model Fight. It was like my pocket counter pick to Model Fight. So yeah, there is that. A little bit of Aloy's lore. I actually like Nasus a lot, but the problem with Nasus, with how the game has shaped since then, like with means being faster, response time, like all, the way the top lane works right now is, I just feel like when you play Nasus. You don't control the game yourself. You're left to the mercy of your opponent. That is how it very often goes uh, in top lane. I think Nasus mid lane, for example, is way more playable. In fact, there is a top 10 player that plays Nasus and kill mid right now on the US server. All right. Uh, rank the matchup. Should be pretty hard, but let's see. I think I hard outskill the champion. But early game, it's super tricky because he can get on top of me, right? And I always say that champions, can, for my feeling, anything that can get on top of me counters me. Is Nasus still a counter pick to Mole Fight? You can play it into Mole Fight, you outskill, but it's not as free, I would say. If you want a real counter pick to Mole Fight, you should go like Cho'Gath or Sion. They can, like, or Zac. Mole Fight gets countered by other tanks. Do you think Nessus is a no-skill champion? Well, it's really easy to play Nessus, but the skill expression in Nessus isn't in his kit, it's in his macro, it's in his uh, decisions with wave management and all that stuff. So, I wouldn't say Nessus is a very skilled champion, but the decisions you have to make to make him work are kind of skilled. This is how you should type to your jungler. I would prefer to start lane if that's fine, bro. Even the most toxic jungler would be like, it's all right then. It's all right. But okay, let's focus on this level one so I don't get like full cheats. He's playing D-Blade Conqueror and he's already here. So I can auto Q trade and that is a fine trade. Oh, his W start. Now that's interesting. Okay, that wasn't good. No, that was not good. Because now he also... No, nah, his next W just destroys me, by the way. I should have never done this. What Rankin should do is never touch this wave right now and like... Okay, maybe I should have ride it differently, but I think it's just unlucky. What the Rankin should have done is like... Not hit this wave at all, because now it's pushing it to me. So I can actually play. What I should have done is let the mains do the work itself, stand in front of the wave and zone me from walking up and get 50 fury and absolutely destroy me. But now, because they pushed the wave, I'm not forced to walk up, so, so I'm actually fine. So yeah, we lose the XP because I have traded, which I shouldn't have, right? And I learned from this. But uh, the ranked end could have absolutely, absolutely, absolutely destroyed me. Way harder. Does that make sense, chat? Type 1 in chat that makes sense what I was trying to iterate. Because you kind of have to, like, visualize it, right? What I'm saying. But it shouldn't be too hard to visualize. I can't get any of these minions. Okay, nice. Oh, that sucks. Wait, he just warped on my screen. Uh, well, I got the caster. Well, I got the caster. He can dive me. I got a potion. I played this matchup extremely poor. He could try and dive me still. Oh, no, never mind. I gotta queue everything so I also sustain. Is 
Ah. If I press W there. Okay. Oh, well, I've managed this very poorly. My farm is very low. Uh, but I should have enough time here to push this wave out. Okay, he has no E right now. Well, he has the movement of Michael Jackson, though, unfortunately. Am I dead? Man, I need to land some of my E's. If I landed one of those three E's, this matchup would have been better. Doing good, sexy man. <laughs> Thank you, King Kong. I'm doing alright. Thank you for asking. Doing better with you here. I'm gonna try and play this out, chat. I need to land the C. I'm dead. I get level 5 from the cannon. Okay, finally. We do get the wave in because we get the level up, but look, he's already 26 and I'm 20 CS. We are infinitely further behind in CS. But in terms of EXP, we've missed nothing. So we are still fine in the game, and he's actually going to lose quite some gold and EXP here, because he was greedy with his trading patterns. <coughs> Holy moly! Sorry, but like, unholy CSing by your boy. I think I'm fine. He's losing the full wave. Oh, he's mad. He lost the full wave doing that, by the way. He's only just at level 5, and I'm already 5.5, and, and I lost 0 XP. So I'm, I'm happy with this. Because of the decisions that the ranked have made here. But if this ranked was a better player, I, I would have been so screwed. I can, I can tell you three things that ranked could have done different. And, and my game would have been absolutely unplayable. Camille's roaming here. That's nice. If Camille doesn't share any of my XP, I get level 6 exactly from this wave, by the way. Which is something the ranked might not anticipate. I get a freeze here as well. We are still 10 CS down, but we can farm 4 here. So we're like 10 CS down, yeah. Uh, again, King Kong, thank you for the tier 1 for 6 months, brother. I appreciate it a lot. I need to make sure I only Q1 and not Q again, because if I Q again right now, the ghouls spawn, and I don't want that because I have a freeze. So I want to make sure I only press Q once, and that's it. I'm going to release the finger. Because if I press Q twice accidentally, I spawn the ghouls, goodbye to my freeze. I also don't understand quite why the Rankton decided to reset here. But hey. If I land the E, he loses so much HP. F is a big word. Okay, we finally landed one, but there's no stacks nearby. Wait, why did they spawn? Oh, he's dead now, right? I MIGHT be upset! Sorry. Yeah, now he's six. Now I can't kill him anymore. If just a single E had landed this lightning phase, man. But this guy also has good move. There's a planted in river that I can play for chat. Which is what I should consider. I press Q accidentally twice. That's not what I wanted, but it's alright. What I can also just do, I push this wave and reset. And we at least kill. We're still fine. Right, we're not in a bad position. I just could have had some kill pressure. Yeah, I think we just hard push this and reset. Oh, baby. How's that feel, piggy? Jump, boys. Jump, boys. And now we get a reset in. I can buy double longsword refill. I'm going to leave my ward right here. The reason I leave this ward chat is because what the ranked is going to do is he's going to collect this wave and then probably hard push this wave to set up his reset, right? But the reason I put this ward here is so I can see where he's going to reset because he's going to push this, right? If he stays... I could maybe find this recop. I mean, he actually pushes so fast, so it doesn't really matter. But let's say in a world where it doesn't push this fast, maybe I have this ward so I can see him recall here or here, and I can look to cancel. That's why I get the ward down. Yeah, 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 Valby, that's what I thought as well, yeah. All right, we're even in CS, but uh, I misplayed quite a lot with my E's, but this Rankton has really misplayed with his reset timers and with what he could have done. If this Rankton 
I I'll show you guys to the replay what the Renekton should have done. That would have instantly lost me in my lane, okay? And, and it's extremely important to know because I made so many blunders this game. And if my opponent knew how to punish them, it was it was done. So it's going to be interesting for you guys to see. Like, even though we're even right now, we really shouldn't be. And I want to show you guys how important this is to understand the importance of those first wave, as, as I always said, right? I think I'll spawn my four homies here. Wait, this guy didn't recall. He's still only two long swords in. Literally, I could be topside though. I'm gonna leave four homies behind here so I can spawn them later. Okay. That sucks. Oh. These, these grenades are gone. Nice. My first strike will get proc here still, I think. No, it doesn't. A little too early. My Q deals a lot more. Oh. I did waste both my cooldowns there. I mean, the thing is, I get to free scale here, so... We're gonna get to our Eclipse without dying, which is amazing. My flesh is coming back too. But the... <laughs> Alright, if I land this next E, I'm Faker. If I miss, I deserve to get punished in game I know. Please land. I'm Faker. Alright, nice. I needed that one for mental boost, okay chat? I needed that one for mental boost very badly. There we go. Uh, I got an ult. He used W on the thing. Ah, the burn is too much. Okay, I actually still die. I stopped thinking about the Lilia. The problem is that I'm just short of my item now too. I can sell my refillable for 60 gold, but it's still just a little bit short. And that kind of sucks. Uh, well, the thing is I'm gonna have to walk back to light anyways. Actually, I think I wait. I should wait. It's better for me to wait here. I'm losing this entire wave anyways. You know, no, I 100 percent wait. I'm gonna get blow trinket. Uh we're in a good position. I should have just never died there though. The, the death is absolutely unnecessary. But as per usual, the most important fundamental is having the better teammates. And as per usual, I get a better team. That is why I can go to Master and have a champion, and you guys can't. Smolder top unranked to master when? Uh, it's not a top laner, so probably never. 16 10 top. Hey, well done, T. Jonash. That's amazing to read, brother. Ranked and died, so I'm gonna get some plates here for free. Yeah, I wanna stack these three up. The Thank you, Speckless Tactics, for the primer. Appreciate boss. Okay, gotta focus the game here, okay? I've been playing pretty, pretty, pretty poorly. Right, should have TP, but I can get maybe two plates. We do have three grubs, which is pretty amazing. Very nice. He's gonna do a lot of damage here to him. He also has Eclipse, so we're kind of dead even, but he does have boots as well. Look at that, that E just did have his HP, guys. Like, I, we're, we're good. I can play with ranges while he can't. But if he ever gets on top of me, we heart lose. It's just that we have flash uh, advantage for like a minute now, or four minutes over him now too, which is massive. But he's gonna get his ult a little bit faster than me. So I gotta be careful here. He wins in the full all-in, I win in the small trades. I have done Trundle on rank to master, but I did it at the end of season 13. And so I didn't upload it because it would instantly be outdated. And as a result of that, I will redo it. Two stacks. Oh, try to dodge that piggy. Jump him, bros. Jump this. Oh. Oh. Card result is coming up soon. 13.
I gotta remember that I have flush advantage, and I'm still terrible at landing my ease. Suck him out, buddy! Suck him out, buddy! Oh, shit. Land. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, bros. Ah, but I stopped walking. I should have kept walking. Is a very successful player. Man. That's right. He loses the wife and I can get a lot of plates here. If he stays, I kill him. So we're still fine. Seymour 5000, David Prime, brother. Appreciate it. Thank you for the support. Alright, we get the full turret still. We're in a good position, but hey. We have zero kills or assist. I could have got a kill there, and I lost my flash. And the problem is, Rank is gonna have his flash back. I won't have flash, so we're probably gonna die at least once of not having flash. I can do the Herald here, maybe. I get two bros. Oh, I can spawn the third, my bad. We're in a good position, though. Oh, there's a pink gourd. Should have maybe done Scuttle. Okay, they killed Rise, though, so we should have mid prio. We're fine. I think I can do this easily. Give it. To me, give to me, please. Okay, very nice. I get the gold and XP from it. Uh, there's smolders that are in condition, kind of right now. There's three homies here. I want them to do. Not I'm gonna stay with the wave, but I can maybe get some graves. Please follow me. Alright, will they do that? That's not enough, right? Maybe they jump still? Nice, they come here. Cartus, just don't look over here, please. Cartus, please don't look. <laughs> okay, he says why. Uh, I'm gonna ping this. 500 only. Close enough. Do I win this? Oh, I landed, chat. But I don't kill him. Not even close. Holy shit! Eclipse! Eclipse! Ah, I shouldn't go for that, man. Ah, I thought I would get it. It was so close. Uh, the thing is, I die here, chat, but he also gets my full turret, so it's it's like double whammy. Double negative. Double nicht good. I should have just used my a position there to secure my reset and I'd be in a fine spot. I don't think the Camille wins. You're five levels down, that's an issue. Ah, We're in a bad position now, chat, but we can still skill, that's alright. Do you go Bruce Yorick? Not really, I've mainly been going with Arty. So, we're still fine because we have good gold income, but Renton just killed me and Camille, got both solo XP, so he's almost level 13 and he got the full turret. So, we're, we're screwed, but this Rise is still super weak, so I can always try and position myself to Rise in the side lane. My card is very strong, I have a lot to play with, luckily, right? My team is doing well, uh, and I died there. On my own decision. I could have just lived there and be f like, I, I shouldn't have died there. I decided to flip it, wasn't good to flip. Lilia is very strong as well. Small is very strong. So my mid jungle is stronger, their bot lane is stronger. Okay, that's massive though. Wait, the 7 and 1 small didn't have a shutdown. That's kind of weird. Uh, Ranked is gonna probably have a full item and be level 13 here, so I'm gonna back off. And, yeah, there he is. Okay, I didn't get a full item. I'm gonna TP here, and we can uh, Herald here. Because right to the stop is gonna collect these two waves here. So I'm gonna TP mid here, and I wanna Herald. And I probably want to sideline into Rice, but it's also maybe bad for my Fizz to put him into the Rankton. I'm gonna use my Herald here. Duck killer 2000, take it to Prime. Why are you killing ducks, uh, boss man? Hey Alois, would you say as he is the best Riven player in the world? I eat W tier, but it's not gonna be enough. There's nobody nearby, everybody's in reset, wait. I almost- what? WHAT?! I almost killed her! I'm 0-2! I almost killed the Lilia! 
I mean, my EW was good, but I didn't even have to made it. If I spawn made it, maybe she actually dies. What? That's crazy. Does Fizz win? I don't think so. I really hope he does, but I don't think he does. Yeah. Wait, he's him. Ranked and flushed. Okay. He did die, so I think it's worth it. We push here. Two people mid. Rice was there. Oh, it's Lilia. Oh, I got it! Man! Four people mid, I'm gonna ult. I can get the full tier 2 turret. I'm still getting a lot of resources here. If I had TP, I would TP top here to also push this turret. And then recast the maiden so it stays bot, but it's alright. We're still fine here. I'm gonna keep pushing. Ranked is gonna respawn without ult and flash. But I probably can get a lot more than this. I should probably just retreat for the dragon. Although Camille wants to look here. She's almost gonna die from that. She died from that. Uh oh. I'm killing the Camille. Okay, we live. The wife lives as well. What a weird game. Uh, we can get the blue buff. If I kill that many 20, my entire team gets it, right? So I should wait with killing it so my entire team can get it. Be a good uh, teammate here. So I'm going to wait with hitting it so that my entire team can benefit from this. Oh, please stop, wife. Wife, wife, stop sucking. Okay, good. It upgraded. That's weird. i never seen an animation of the upgrade. Mad. Dude, the crazy part is that I'm very close to my third item now. But I'm like so weak at the same time. Like I oh, I could sell for the full item. I think it's worth it. I'm three items, even though I'm one and two. I only have four hundred gold here. Pretty good. He's level fourteen though. But he's no flash at oh. He ulted at least. I'm gonna go bot lane. If these small guys die. I'll get some. Homies, there we go, and they'll do this for me. We got third dragon, that's good. Noise. I'm gonna keep pushing bot lane. I'm three items strong. I'm. I'm pretty strong, so we're fine here. Uh, I have flash advantage to the your uh, to the ranked, so I don't think he can kill me unless I really miss position. We can get the Gromp here too. Wait, are they on this? I've TP into. That's a goner. I can't move. I didn't. Consider Baron. That's my bad. I'm just gonna push. Even if I move, I'm already too, too late, so there's no point for me moving. But maybe I can get a turret. And if my enemy if my if we maybe kill somebody. No. That's bad though. What I could do is all tier and TP top. Because they all want to reset, right? So the mate is gonna keep pushing and I'm TP top. So now I'm pushing two waves at once. Oh wait, we are dead. No. I, I, shut down! Shut down! Are you kidding me? I should have flashed. Oh, I should have kept here. That was not good. Why did I turn shut down? Oh shit, the game's hard now. We all died. Okay, I want some... The music is chill, but let's reset the playlist here. Here it's like good, good. But like, ah, dying there, it's like... Well, my bad. I just... I think I should have kept pushing bot, first of all, because enemy team had to recall and then move to me. But here, I kind of TP to them, right? This guy has three items now as well. And mercs. And mechanics. That was a good fish. That was a terrible fish. Uh, the rank is unstoppable. In literally. But! No, I don't have a but. Chelsea, you think you're the prime. They were the 12. They were the year. Baby, let's go. My man, I appreciate it, bro. Um, I kind of feel like I've made too many mistakes now. My best place to probably still split push.
Uh, what is this guy's flesh timer? 20 seconds he gets flesh. This guy runs me down. He's two levels above me. I do still skill chat. I do still have insane scaling. My champion at, at full items is a monstrosity. But yeah, it's gonna be pretty hard to get there. Ranked and going mid is amazing for me because then I can push the side lane. And it's bad for me to group because my champion sucks grouped. But by pushing side lane, I can at least draw pressure. I might even get I just have to try and wave clear. I'm gonna push the side wave. Rice comes to me would be amazing. Uh, it's probably gonna be the ranked though, and he's gonna kill my ass. But I'll try to make it hard for him. He just has too much healing for me to kill him, I think. I'm gonna try it though. Bro, I feel like I'm playing this really good. Yeah, the flash was uh, suboptimal. My damage there, though, I think I did like 10k damage there, minimum. Like, I already did 10k damage in that fight. So that's good, but... I think I won't be ranked in there, with the card assault. If it's just ranked in, my W placement was perfect. I had E into all the ghouls hitting him, into ult into all the ghouls hitting him. And then I died. <laughs> then I just died. Oh, my bad. I should have flashed. The flash was so bad. I need my flash. One v one, I would win. If we die here, okay. At least we die before the dragon. Not bad. What? How did he kill the Rankton? We can play for the soul. Lilia not having flesh is amazing. So now we have soul in a minute, right? My thought process now is, I'm pretty useless in t in, in team fights. Can I maybe pressure somewhere so my team can play for the dragon easier? And my thought is probably literally just pushing our bot. And if I push it with my maiden, I think my team can do the... But maybe I should group. Maybe I should group. I think grouping is a, is a lost cause though, but hey, we're gonna try it. We're gonna figure it out. Next item is Edge of Night, and then I'm gonna go for Hydra. Or I instantly go Hydra, honestly. I just sit on the dirt and I go Hydra. That's also good. I shall perform your right. Well, Rankin is still dead. This is gonna push. Do I die doing this? Oh, yes, I do. It's you they seek. I don't know, chat. I feel like I should just push both. I start pushing. I start pushing. I, I just think it's the best play I can do, and I hope my team can do something with the pressure. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna like go here, search the limits, and, and then TP top or something. We didn't get it, but I'm gonna get a lot here. I'm useless in team fights, right? Wait, two people died. Wait a second. Wait a second, chat. Wait a minute. There's three people there, so... Wait a second. I'm one in four. I've been griefing all game, but my champion can do one thing, that's split pushing. <laughs> yeah! my, my team just played very well, I, I, like, I, I can't take any of the credits, but hey. Uh, 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 wait a minute, uh, uh, wait a minute. Top gap! 50kp, 1kp, top! Nah, uh, shut my mouth, man. Hey, K slows though, I told you, I shouldn't join team fights, I should just keep trying to split push. I find the window there. We found the windows. Chat, I need to show you how Rankton could have won the lane level one, okay? This is very important. Take out your notebooks. Watch and learn. The Ye gets it. I want to show you guys how this Rankton could have won the lane level one without giving me a way back, okay? Music will go out. This is important, okay? Focus, chat. Focus. Focus. Okay? Very, very important. So, you're gonna see the bro, me, make a very, very big blunder, okay? Watch this. So, Alois said multiple things. First of all, I said, my dearest jungler, I don't want to leash it, and he went AFK, but that's okay. What's very important here, chat, is this mistake that I do. Renekton is a stronger level 1 champion than Yorick. I always say, your first, how many? Four waves 
are the most important in your laning phase because if you fall behind in your first four waves, most of the result or most of the rest of your laning phase is going to be a direct result of those first four waves. And the game starts at level one, even before the means arrive. Now this trait here it looks okay. Now it's terrible already, right? Now it's already terrible because Rennington is a stronger champion than me, level one. Now it's horror. It is absolute horror. So if you look at the frame right here, I want to challenge all your thinking and I want to ask you, how should the Rennington play to make me lose the game? Like, give me no chance in the laning phase because there are things that Rennington can do right now that would genuinely end my laning phase or at least make me fall behind without any counterplay. The reason I want to lose this Yo, is Z is Zebra, I'm, do I'm doing very well. Thank you for four Hello, months. Bro, Thank you for tier you one. Doing? Abuse you. Yes, he should zone me from the EXP. And I, I explain this thoroughly every time. And that is that EXP snowballs harder than gold in the early game. And that is because multiple reasons. First of all, if you zone your opponent for the first three melees worth of EXP at wave one, you perpetually put your opponent behind in level up timers. And the reason why this is so important is that if you are a level up above your opponent, you are 600 gold ahead of them in terms of stats. Because if you level up, you get like 90 HP, which is like like a, like two-thirds of a ruby crystal, right? You get AD, you get armor, you get attack speed, you get magic resist. So you get all those stats, right? So they spawn in your inventory on top of the fact that you get an extra ability, right? Which is also extremely important. So you get all those stats and an extra ability. So if you are perpetually... Three melee means ahead of your opponent in the laning phase that is going to disjoint level up timers where you are going to be level two when your opponent is level one. Rankton will be level three when I'm level two. And that makes it so I can never really play the game. Now, why is this so important? Because it would doom my laning phase. So what Rankton should do here, okay, is stand here where I am standing. And if he stands here, you can see the problem that would lead to is that I'm never allowed to walk up here. I, I physically couldn't walk up here because he gets his W again. He can stack to 50 Fury and, and I'm doomed because if I walk up, I, I already I, I lose because he's strong at level one, right? So he, he should never push this wave. Him hitting here is the biggest blunder because it would start making the wave push towards me. And if the wave pushes to me, that means I'm not forced to walk up for last hits. If I'm not forced to walk up for last hits, I'm not in danger because I can just wait till the wave comes into me, right? So, what Rennington should have done is literally stand here, let the means do the work, zone me from the first three means worth of EXP. If I walk up, he auto auto W's me, I'm dead. Or I have to flash. And if not, uh, he gets the E should stand like here, where he gets the EXP and I don't, and already the lane is really doomed. And then he can decide an early wave crash, and he could do a second wave crash or a third wave crash. I would say second wave crash would be the best, because if after that he does a second wave crash, the wave would put, crash to my turret, bounce away from me and guess what happens then i am going to be forced to walk up for lessons but remember if i'm forced to walk up for lessons i'm vulnerable and he's level three when i'm level two he'd be level four when i'm level three because of the first four waves in the game you can get level four you get level two from uh the first melee in wave two you get level three from first two waves plus two melees and then you get level four from first three waves three melees and one caster however if you lose those three melees you cannot get level four from the first four waves Rennington still would get level four he still gets level three faster so i would need the first two waves plus three melees and the cannon to get my level three right whereas Rennington would only need the first two waves and two melees and again, to 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 uh, to so Rector would need the first two waves, two melees to get his level three. I would need the first two waves, three melees, and the ca cannon to get my level three because he's only from the first three mains worth of EXP. So again, this is why EXP snowballs way faster than gold in the early game, and why it's so important to do that. And he had the absolute dominion to do this. Does that make sense now? I tried to explain it in the game, but it's very hard because you have to visualize it, right? So what Rankin should have done is never push this wave into me, but stand here and zone me from the first three means worth of EXP. And depending on how I react to that, my best play would literally be to never walk up. But if I ever walk up, which 90% of the players would do, you win the lane. It's done. It's done. Yapping for real? I'm giving you this to you guys for free right now. You guys should be thankful. You piggies. You little piggies yes but don't shout okay i'm sorry what about those stat checkers 
levels such as Trundle or Darius. Well, that's why you need to play Trundle and Darius to the maximum ability in the level one. Yes, you win a lot of your lanes. Like, I win... When I was playing Darius, I was winning so many lanes. Even when I played Riven as well at level one. You can win your entire laning phase from level one. Some people low-key pay 100 euros an hour to get that exact talk. Well, it's way more personalized, depending on the champion that you play and all that stuff. But it's okay. What if you walk up with the wave? So the wave, let him hit if he tried to hit you. Uh, yeah, if I'm full HP, I could, but I already lost too much HP, right? Day 2,974 asking for an asset series. Now, that's a lie. Hey, that's a lie. Okay, let's watch... Yorick... Yorick rework? Was it a failure? I like this. I don't think so. I think the new Yorick is absolutely amazing. I think the design of current Yorick is so unique. Like, I'm actually falling in love with this champion, which is something I didn't expect. What do you mean you can't hear? We can't hear, right? Louder? Oh, you want it louder. Okay, yeah, okay. I can make it louder. That's no issue. Um, What's my favorite champion on the ranked MS? I like Kill Lot, but Yorick might be my favorite thus far, actually. Yorick might be my favorite. Is this loud enough? Is that loud enough, chat? The problem that is with Yorick, and why this champion... Wait, by the way, I, f I completely missed this. Kaja da Riven, are you still here? You gave me a $5 donation, asked me, would you say Ozzy is the best Riven player in the world? I completely missed it. Are you still here, buddy? I am so sorry. I don't know why I didn't hear it or, or notice this. I hope you're still here. Um, I think Wen Shen is probably the best Riven in the world, not Ozzy. I also played against Ozzy when I was in Korea. He's good, but I don't think he's the best. He's very good, very, very good, but I don't think he's the best. And yes, uh, what I was saying is yes, Yorick is an extremely, extremely weak early game champion. And like I said, especially at the higher levels, your laning phase gets decided in the first four waves. And if your opponents properly know how to punish you, like the rank that could have punished me last game, my lane would have been over, instantly over. And yeah, that is the issue that this champion is super weak in your first four waves. I don't think I'm the best Riven in the world. Not by a long stretch. Uh, I, I don't know. I haven't played against Alawi yet. So I wouldn't know how to exactly lane against Alawi. We played this matchup from the Shen perspective. It was a YouTube video too. Will you play your last game of League on Teemo Top? No. And I don't think I'll ever know when I play my last League of Legends game. Unless I get randomly hit with a bus. I wouldn't want to time that. So yeah. Holy, this old build, by the way. Look at this shit. There was already so many disgusting old builds in the past. You have old mana mune, tabbies. These are ninja tabbies. And then shroud with double cloth armor. Oh my days. Oh, shit. Th this does bring back some nostalgia, though. Like, these boots, I just think they look better. This is old lucidity boots. I think this looks better. Mana potion tier and 
this potion as well. You're not able to stack multiple potions. Uh, there's too much nostalgia in this game, actually. Boomer as built. <laughs> not wrong. Uh, I don't think I'm clicking this, by the way. I remember mana potions being removed and then you had Klepto so you could get mana potions still. Man, this game is like, gone through so much. Look at these icons as well. Cho'Gath, Bart, and, and Ezra are the same, but Kale looks different, Vars looks different, Fizz is the same. I mean, Yorick obviously is different. There's just so much different stuff in this game. It's like, I, the thing is, so one very interesting thing is my, my older brother played League around the same time as me, but he quit like eight years ago. So his perspective on the game is so much different and he can, he can remember these old things very well. I don't. I've forgotten like everything, but when I see it again, then it kind of comes back, you know? Who's the best counter to Heimer Danger? Aurelia? Syndra? Karthus? These champions? Alright. Um, the music is going to be pretty loud, so I'll do it like this. Um, this matchup, I think... So I played it as Shen. This matchup is actually pretty tricky for Yorick, because Shen can jump on you, and he outstat checks you when you're fighting in melee. But my E range, hard outranges his E range. So I can kind of decide when I want to get in range with him. And after level 6, he can't do anything anymore. Pre 6 is very hard though. Yorina, I'm doing pretty well, thank you for asking. Uh, and if he ever holds away, I can just get like the entire landing phase. So it's like in a matchup where I just lose early game, but I will hard out skill. So yeah. If you played since season 1, can you hit me with old league question? I have not played in season one. I think the earliest I played was like start of season three, or maybe I watched and or maybe played the game at the end of season two. But I can I can ask you one thing. What is the old meta build on AD carries? Like the old meta build on AD carries. I think it was built on like every AD carry. So you can think about it. Hello guys, I'm Alan. Raphael Kauf, thank you for the prime. You would go, I think, three Phantom Dancers, two Bloodthirst, and an Infinity Edge or something. You'd go like three Phantom Dancers, two Bloodthirst, and one Infinity Edge. Something like this. Okay, wait, I gotta focus on the game chat. He's playing aggressive too. He has very aggressive sword placement. Though he's pushing it to me though, but my, I, I kind of gave him free Dominion after level one. Okay, this is good. The auto queue there. And I get this minion because the minions were aggroed onto him because he hit me there. You gotta be very wary of not letting Shen drag his blade through you, chat. A lot of people don't know this, but if Shen drags his blade through you, he gets extra percentage damage and extra attack speed. So never allow him to drag his blade through you because that's actually where all his damage comes from. So be careful. And he's level 2, so of course I'm never gonna walk up, because if he is through me and then Qs, he drags his blade through me automatically, right? So it's insane amount of burst. But he's kind of doing a weak level 3 with pressure. I'm in my happy spot. I'm... This trade is alright, but you see, that's half my HP, because he E into Qs. I tried to get the melee. I'm not too unhappy with this trade, because I can sustain here, and the wave is very close to my turret. What I am going to do is get my ward down here so I can see his recoil. I always do this when I play in the week in the early game, right? So let myself get pushed in and look for a ward. Oh, this is bad. This is very bad. I'm in the die. I get a flash. Because if I let myself get hit more there, on his next D, I get dove. This was very bad. Very bad gameplay by me. But I have the best fundamental, aka better team. GG. Watch this. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Nah, this last hitting. Yo, I have heart improved that. Sorry, so I should have yelled. I get level four, level four here. I'm gonna W, I might get a splash back. Wait, well, he dragged his blade through me. I gotta be a little bit careful. And he has ignite, right? But I'm level four to level three. That's why I'm so confident. Uh, There's a dog. A dog. A dog. I, I need them to push the wave, but if they're smart, they reset. If they're smart, they reset. Yeah. Uh, shit, man. I didn't consider Warwick Path to the top. I'm an idiot. We were excited. I should have thought about that. I made so many fundamental mistakes here. Like, trading so much level 2. 
Not thinking of the jungle pathing. So many mistakes here by me. It's alright though. Shen is kind of stuck because he's playing Flushing Knight, but I could get reganked here. And I am probably going to get reganked. I am already getting reganked. I am dead. I got a Dutch's Flesh Taunt. That was a really good wall placement, but I'm not sure if it's enough. Okay, this wave should crash almost. I wanted to reset, of course. So I can actually play. I made some mistakes here. And the thing is, I would have loved for Lilia to reset, come back top, but uh, Lilia is just taking the second clear of Warwick. Warwick could still be here, and there's not much I can do about it, because it's a result of my early game mistakes. That landed? Really? He's level 5 too. I'm dead. But the wave will push into me. It's alright. It's just, this is a result of my early game mistake. Like, this death is a direct result of my earlier death. And, uh, yeah. The wave will at least push back into me. I'm not sure if Shen has enough pushing power to push this in before I'm back. I hope I'm back in time. Because then I can actually freeze this. And then we kind of stabilize. But I think he's in time. Although, I could be in time here. maybe. No, I, I can definitely freeze this. So that's good. We can look here. If my Lilia wants to come. No F. So I'm gonna hard to communicate here with my jungler. I need her here because oh shit, it's level six. <laughs> oh yo 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 yo. No, I, I made so many blunders again. I'm I'm playing my lanes very poorly. But it's also good because you guys can see clearly where I still make stupid mistakes myself, right? So you can learn from that. I'm gonna hold this wave though, perpetually here. Perpetually is my new word. I'm gonna W here to hold these means locked here in the cage. I only want to kill once. I'm going to take the aggro of this minion so they don't walk into the turret, but they aggro onto me. And I hold it out of the turret range. Yeah, you know, I I, I knew that Chen beats me before level 6. I, I said that, I mentioned that heading into the laning phase. I just made a very big blunder trading so much at level 2. However, Shen did lose a full cannon wave and a full normal wave. So in terms of XP, we're back even. The second death wasn't that bad. It was a result of my, but my first death was extremely bad. Uh, Shen ult admit, I assume. He went Sheen, though. Pretty awful build path. I'm not sure why he's going Sheen. We do have the f wave frozen here. We actually had CS now. And the wave's still in a very uh, good position for me. But yes, my early two deaths here were completely avoidable. It was mainly due to my early trades here. And then how far I overextended on the trade afterwards. That's all right. Oh no, I pressed Q accidentally for the second time. Ah, uh, well, the freeze is gone. Maybe it's meant to be. <coughs> I gotta get this wave in now, preferably without ulting. Warwick died bot lane, so I don't have to be scared of a gang now. And I believe Warwick will actually go bot side again. I can spawn my goose here. So I spawned three more homies, so I don't have to use my ult for that. I think I kind of want to slow push this and then hard push on this wave and then set up my reset. But with the goose, it's kind of going a little too fast. I need this wave to walk past the turret here so I can farm it in a relatively safe position, right? So we are doing that here. Nice. And then I got to prioritize getting this wave. We get level 7 here. This e lens it's massive. Unfortunate. I got to prioritize getting the wave in over anything else. And there we go. Okay, mid is losing, bot is winning. Wait, I sh Do they follow me? Nice, I get three ghouls with me now on my reset. So that's good, I'm gonna go back into lane with three extra ghouls. I probably lose this play, but it's still better to recall here. Uh, so that I get my reset in and that I can play out the bounce. We're in a fine position. In the 1v1. How to spawn your monsters with Yorick? Basically, once you have three graves, and it's either with your passive or with your Q kill, you spawn a grave. And once you have three, you can recast your Q and you can spawn them. Or, if you land your E, you don't need three goose, you can just spawn the goose by landing your E. <laughs> I'm not sure where my coaching will be back. It's very dependent on how I feel. Well, once I feel a little bit less overworked. I first want to keep updating my courses and uh, make my new Riven course before I start... Solo coaching again, so it's gonna take a while. If anything, if you're interested in my coaching and in my teaching, I would highly recommend checking out my courses over anything else. Noise. Warwick is top side. He is level 6. He is a Tiamat. So I check his level, I check his items to kind of decipher how strong he is at this frame. 
I can spawn four more homies here. Uh, that's because I'm going for an Eclipse name myself. Wait, I have a double- I have a second point in my W. That's a mistake, by the way. That's an absolutely useless upgrade as well. Lilia is hovering here, so I'm not scared of a gank. I'm waiting for him to- oh. I caged them both. Chat- Hey, I played that so well, without sucking myself off. Hey, chat. I mean, his ult was terrible. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta say that his ult was terrible. Like, it was kind of predictable. But I got Dodge's ult, and then I caged them both. I landed my E, and then my E did all the damage. I ulted the goose do all the damage again. Beautiful. We're back in the game. I've fixed my ult mistakes, and we're in the main position now. I don't want to get the full turret because it's only ten minutes in the game. And it's gonna be hard to progress afterwards. So I think you just want the grubs. We're gonna have six grubs, which will help me a lot later in the game. My, if you kill uh, peop or any minion next to your maiden, by the way, you see it instantly spawns. So that's one thing to memorize. Warg is bot. Nice. I'm gonna kite my ult away here. I don't think my means will take the turret, so I can just recall on his face. I get a clips. I could also go for this, though. I think Eclipse is better. And then we'll go Longsword. He TPs. I'm gonna ult. Or TPs uh, rather here. And an insta ult. Wait, I still have my ult. Never mind. I'm griefing. I'm gonna get the turret and I'm gonna get the grubs. I'm just gonna get maximum resources here now. Now I'm fine with it. I have all my items too. I'll get so much from getting this, so it's alright. I can maybe even get enough tempo to get the tier 2 turrets here. And tier 2 turrets get 700 gold. Shen is recalling now, but I'm gonna prioritize getting as much damage- Oh wait, I should've eat this. Never mind. I'm gonna get as much damage on the tier 2 turret as I can. Shen stayed even. This is so massive, chat. If I get this- Wait, my ult is in range. Shit. Oh man, that- What? That is so bad, chat. I don't spawn extra goose now. And I stepped away. It's okay, I should get the tier 2 turret here though, but now I don't keep the small homies. And the issue with that is it's going to be hard for me to do the grubs here. But I do get the full tier 2, so I never really have to do anything in top lane again. And so we are in a very, very, very privileged position here. I want to get 4 stacks here, and then spawn them by going for the gromp, and then let them chase me. So here, I'm going to get my 4 stack. And I'm gonna spawn them and eat this. So they're gonna go here. And they're gonna help me get this. And then I'm gonna make them help me do the grubs as well. And then I wanna go into bot lane. I wanna queue this so it spawns another one. But I can't spawn it actually, never mind. Okay, I'm actually gonna go like this. Their Valkus is 5 and 0, but no shutdown. That's interesting too. Six grub will just help me split push the rest of this game, right? That's one. Three stacks here. Six grub is amazing. I need 2.5k before my reset, so I want to get that before I reset. And then I probably want to go bot, right? Because there's nothing for me to really get on top lane anymore. My mains will finish this off. They will do that without me. They get the first dragon, but it's okay. We get the six grubs, which I think is super worth it. I have a fat shot down because of the sheer amount of gold that I've gotten from like plates, turrets, all that stuff. There's my bros. So let's get this wave in to 2.5k gold, reset, get tempo on top lane, and then I'm gonna go bot. My bot is winning, my mid is losing. Okay, that's good to know, Shimmy Shuffle. Thank you for that. Same with champions, right? Yeah, sure, right. I think this group might respawn by the time I've gotten this wave. Uh, can I go bot, please? I'm gonna ask that like that. Harold is in 40, but there's no th nothing for me to stay in topside for 40 additional seconds. I get level 11 too. No thank you. You should go... Uh, they don't want to go bot. I can see why Vayne doesn't want to go bot against Valkos. So then I think I will just go top. <laughs> the thing is, I understand from Vayner's perspective that she just doesn't want to go mid against a level 11 fat Valkos. Um, still no? Yeah. So 
I can see his point. I'll have to pee in 40 seconds. I'm gonna E ult here. I wanna make sure I take this. If I last it, I also get extra gold, but my Lydia is pretty behind, so maybe I should give it to her. No, oh, decided against it. Warwick is here, full Titanic. You see, I instantly check his item when I see him, right? So I can kind of judge how strong he is. I engage them both. I have two items here. I should be pretty strong. Beautiful. It got sucked out. Nice. I got two items, right? So I know I'm very strong there. And I want this too. Take that for me, please, bros. Got some passive income strategies. I'm going to push our top all the way. Uh, reset, probably go bot. I might even go bot with my bot lane so I can spawn there out and get those turrets. Alright, we're very strong now. I'm getting to 10 cents per minute as well. Wait, my mains already took off the care of the wave here. I'm almost back to full of chickens at the healing. Uh, again, their mid, their mid lane is their win condition mainly. They attack me here, I think I'm fine, because Warwick also doesn't have ult. He almost dies from that. Alright, never mind, his W is too broken. The six grub, your gameplay is kind of crazy though. He's kind of getting sucked, chat. That's worth it. Uh, Warwick is dead. Vel yeah, Valkus is here. Valkus is here. Run, run, wipe, 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 all right, we're in the main position. Remember, we started this game 0-2, chat. We started 0-2. <coughs> mm. I think it's actually better for me to Herald mid so that this Valkus turret dies. I'm gonna Herald it here. I don't think we need it. I don't think I need it for the tier 2. It's gonna be way harder to break this mid tier 1, so I think it's just better to Herald mid lane for my team. Especially if they kill the Valkus here. Okay, he flashed. That's a massive cooldown. Because the Valkyrie is in win condition. You take this mid tier 1, we get flanks from here, from here. It's a lot harder for them to be able to play. I don't have my ult for 50 seconds, so if Warwick attacks me now, I am dead. But he is mid, as I anticipated. So I'm going to push here. Thank you, Kyle, for the tier 1 for 14, brother. My, my. And business. Yeah, what a business deal. I'm going to queue here so I get faster wave flare. 35 for my ult. I still got to keep in mind that I got to be careful of the Warwick. But if Shen is there, I don't think the war can 1v1 me, really. I assume Warwick is still looking mid. Yeah, he is. So I get tempo to do 2-2 turret now. And again, that's also why I heralded mid. Kind of proxy. Dude, I have grubs and homies hitting this thing, dude. Like, look how fast I stick this stupid shit, man. What I can do here, chat, is herald. Oh, uh, actually, no. I have uh, ult, rather, and TP to top lane in the second two. But I have to be able to recast it first. If that E lands, I think I almost kill him. So what I'm going to do here, chat, is, is uh, a little tricky. I'm going to ult here, and so it's recasting, it's going to stay here. And now I TP to top, so it won't follow me. It's going to stay bot lane with this wave, and it's going to spawn new homies. And that will pressure bot lane, and I, in the meantime, I take this. I take this as well. You see, I, I'm getting passive income for like four different ways. So this is pushing here with little bros with the wave. I'm taking the Gromp. And I'm taking this turret. Multitasking. Hey, what do we think, Chad? We're taking this and this and this. No All right. This guy's dying to my grubbies. I hit a minion. I'm a pig. Nyla, you want to get the same treatment? All right, bro. Enjoy. Am I getting the turret? <gasps> he killed my wife! Shit. My W was late. Well, chat, you see, I'm not really getting that many kills, but I... Yeah, shit, of stuff. But now I don't have ult, but I have my ult for Baron, and now I can do solo Baron at minute 20. Yes, Yorick can solo Baron at minute 20. What I also like is that I noticed that my CS numbers have been going up. Really nicely lately. Alright, let's recall. 
I can buy this, but I can also buy Edge of Knights. Can I? I think this is better. And now I get another Dirk. Okay, let's take the rep buff. And... Yeah, I want a Nasher at minute 20. Alright, so I'll take this. I kind of should take this at minute 20. But I'm an impatient piggy. Sorry team, I am a salvage pig. But Lilias as well. So it's alright, right? <coughs> well. Goodbye. We're just gonna do solo baron chat. Yep, so what you do is you eat this piggy, spawn the maiden, get three homies, and kill the baron. That's how it goes. Now, you hope that the baron doesn't AoE the same homie at the same time. Because that would just be bad RNG. Okay, he actually killed one grub or one thingy already. Maybe I can't do it because I only have three. Two have already passed. I might actually not have enough here. Because I only have three. No, it's still love. Wait, Warwick is coming. Okay, it was definitely a little closer than I wanted it to be, but that's because we only had three. If you have four, it's way easier. Bear is up. Hey, Bear is gone, though. And I'll get City Arbutz. I went TP top. I have no TP. I'm a pig. Okay, I like it. Did Shen just say why? Oh, never mind. Alright, Shen. Bear done. The fact that this champion can minute 20 Baron every game is still crazy. Crazy. Yes, Frozen P, you can still learn infinite amount of things watching Unranked Master of other champions. The only difference is the items mainly, right? Like, in terms of core fundamentals and everything like that, the game hasn't changed. You still play Aatrox kind of the same way, the items are just different. Alright, we have four homies. Alright, Chad, let's save our E to get some passive income here. Give me that shit, bros. It's not there. Unlucky. Shen is bot. I can one-shot somebody with an E. Three, four people bot. I'm gonna get level 16 here, I think, from this wave. I have six grubs. I have my goose. And I have the maiden. Balance. Look at all this shit. Not level 16. I just want to one-shot this Valkos or somebody. Not like that, though. Wife live. Wife live. Wife live. Very important. Run, wife. Run. Run. No. No! It's alright. Didn't either. It's just a fictional character. Two stacks. Three stacks. Four. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot he does that. And the W counters me pretty hard. Okay, I'm a pig. My bad. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. Why throw Eden and ask her to live? My bad! I'm bad at micromanaging the, the woman. Oh. Alright, uh, now we go profane. Yeah, I need to stop using my E, because I kind of killed the wife. It's my bad. I keep killing her myself. Yes, that's fun. I've only played Lethality Orc, but this week we'll get coached by Slug Dogs. And I will also try the Conqueror and Halo Blade setup, because he mentioned that. I will get coached by Slug Dogs. Alright, level 16 casted in. Why no hole breaker? I don't need it. You really don't need it. I think it's a waste of resources. Uh, if they go here, I just TP and end, no? Where's one, two, three? This one sh If it lands in one shots. I have Edge of Night. He dies. They just jump him. We're doing the same thing, chat. Bridge the gates. 
I don't know, six grubs and minions and a home. One shot him, please. Wait, I have no homies. If I had homies, she'd get one shot. I need homies. Oh, wait, what? The homies are killing her. The wife sucked her out. She's cheating on me in game. Oh, my bad. This is a game. I'll take it. We started 0 2. We ended up here. I love this champion, man. He's just different. He's just different. On the man. Allo, Chief. Could you drop an op.gg review? Hoping to hit gold tonight? Well, for five dollars, I think it's fair. But okay, so I'll I'll give you the open GG review. But I'm gonna make a kind of like a, a disclaimer for the rest of chat. The reason I kind of stop doing open GG reviews is because if I do one, there's gonna be like fifty people sending their open GGs. Please don't. Okay, homie sent a five dollar donation, so I'll give him the open GG review. I think it's only fair. But don't send me twenty open GG reviews. Would recommend Profane Hydra Rush over Eclipse. I definitely want to try it more, actually. I said this as well. I should try it more. All right, can you, can you send me your open AGG? Because it says blocked, blocked URL. So, take it a five, and can you give me the open AGG? Uh, I'll give it to uh, the vein. I don't like Domination Second for Riven. Fiora PTA goes TP beast on yeah Fiora's really good right now. All right, let's take a look at your open GG. All right, how are you not climbing with when I see this kind of stuff? Wait, I need to filter it to rank solo. Uh, again, thank you to five. Um, so. Your Darius is on a negative win rate, but it is your main champion. Um, I'm not sure if Darius should be your main champion when I see the win rates that you are able to pull off on other champions. Um, Ilawi, more the Kaiser, Jax, right? They have way better win rates, so rationally it's a good decision to probably main another champion. Now, I don't think your Jax is that good, actually. You're doing good things on him for sure, but I'm not sure what's leading to this KDA. So, few things I see. First things first, I think your resources, regardless of the champions that you play, are low. Uh, paired with high def, so you die a lot, right? 5.5, 7.3, 6.1, 6.5, and that goes hand in hand with low CS numbers. So what I think that you should be doing um, is two things. Uh, focus as your main foundation to have better lasting in laning phase. Literally make that an active focus. Focus on lasting. You ever watch Karate Kid, you know, where it does like the wax on, wax off shit before it starts fighting? It's his foundation. Your last thing should be your foundation, okay? So learn how to last it. It is just your most important skill. If you're able to last it better than your opponent, even if it's 20 CS, you're already a solo kill ahead of your, mor uh, ahead of your morning, ahead of your opponent. So learn how to last it. Second thing, die less and farm more. So probably join less random team fights and be a far more on the side waves with jungle camps and with side lanes. Of course, sometimes you do have to group, but right now it looks like you're grouping too much. Um, yeah, that would be it. And then consider being a one trick for because what I would recommend for in your shoes is what if you one trick one champion right now for two hundred games? It could be Darius, but. Um, I'm not sure if Darius should be your champion because you're getting so much more success on other champions like Ilawi and Mordecai. Your KDA on Mordecai is amazing. Your average kills on these two champions are, are very impressive. So um, I would consider that upping this to like, let's say a 7 to 8 CS per minute, which should be really possible, and then maybe lowering your depth. Now, I do know that Ilawi just in general dies a lot. It's also the nature of the champion. Jax also, I mean, you, your champions do kind of have a tendency to die more, but I still think it's on the too higher end. Oh, yeah. And that would be my advices for you, boss man. Thank you to five. Good. Good afternoon, bros. Today is an amazing day. I see Kiyoki. That makes sense, yeah? Can you review my open GG? I only have 3.3k points. No, I'm sorry. Uh, okay, let's watch this Yorick rework again, if it was a fail or not, and try to not get Nostalgia Challenge. Bro, 
how did the game ever look like this? What is this? What, what, like this? This is before my age. Like I was, I was a, I was legit like getting, you know, like I was probably still getting breastfed at this time. Like, I don't know. This is way too old for me. Is that gang flank? Oh my days, these old items, shit. They just look so beautiful. We're gonna ban nothing. Uh, so we don't have to do anything. But uh, I need to show you guys. Like, look at this. Old Mirror Mana complete. It looked so satisfying. This is Spirit's Visage, Iceborne Gauntlet, Frozen Heart. I just feel like items look so good. Wait, I need to update the sound again, by the way. I'll make it louder. Sorry, chat. Doing professional streamer stuff now. There you go. Twenty percent damage reduction is crazy in a passive. By the way, I felt like there there are so many broken hidden things in old seasons that are like like if it, if it were to be introduced right now, you'd be like, bro. Also, does anybody remember this item? Does anybody remember this item? That was by far one of my favorite items. This item is just man. We play against Mollify chat. Yes, I remember Frozen Mallet Yasuo or Frozen Mallet um, Nar. Frozen Mallet Nar, that was so disgusting. Kurumi remembers Kurumi. Frozen Mallet Vein Top. Bro, imagine Frozen Mallet still existing. You play against a Vein Top that goes Fleet, uh, Boots of Swiftness, Frozen Mallet. Holy shit, bro. I, I, would, I would scoop my eyeballs out. Probably, like, I, I would genuinely lose the will to live. All right, uh, let's do a Breaking Benjamin this game. I'm feeling a Breaking Benjamin game. <coughs> Enemy bent Aurelia for you, lucky. What if I want to play against Aurelia to try it? We're in Diamond and Marnell chat, so we're transitioning to Diamond games. Yes, I played 3v3. I remember the Vile Maul. Look, this boss. Chat, if you know, you know. Wait, the Vile... Vile Maul. That's what it's called, right? Look. This was the boss in 3v3. 3v3 was a good game mode. Actually, the other day... I still need to reply to the email. There was a homie. When I was like 12 years old. Or something. I like Or like 13 years old. There was one Dutch guy, he was way older than me, nothing weird by the way, but we just like played Twisted Tree Line together, or play like certain game games together, it was just fun. I still remember using Sky back then, but I was like a Minecraft player and sometimes I casually just played League and I played with him. And he sent me an email, I think two days ago, asking if I remember him, I still haven't replied, I, 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 it jumps into my brain now. And he's like married and stuff right now, I read the email, I just didn't reply, he's like married and stuff now, I asked me if I remembered him, I was like, damn that's so wholesome, I actually used to play 3v3 with him. So yeah, that's fun. That's very cool. That's very wholesome.
A lot of a lot of lore today. Alright, let's get the music on. Um, so this game, I don't really have to be scared of the first four waves of like getting cheesed by a mall fight, but I still shouldn't be like disrespectful, right? If you didn't play League, you'd be married with kids right now. Ah, too early. Chat, remind me at the end of the stream if you're still if you're gonna be there, right? If you're here at the end of the stream, please remind me to reply to that email. I have to make that a priority. Yes, the music is too loud. Sorry, there it's fixed. Dude, you, they should bring back Trista Tree Line. They should bring back. Ascension, and they should bring back Dominion. Dominion is where this was at. Hide and seek on Dominion, bro. That was so fun. I'm 23 years old. Aren't you like 30? No, bro. I'm tw I just turned 23. According to the loves man. Thanks. Bro. Okay. Okay, chat. Viego's passing to bot. Kane is doing Raptors, Rap of Crux. He could do level 3 top gank, but I'm gonna look for priority, okay, chat? The reason I look for priority is because if I get my level 2 first, I get pre presence in the lane, right? Because I get my level timers first, I can decide to crash this, I can make it hard for him to farm under the third, all that nice stuff. I just want to prioritize giving super high CS, don't miss any CS, and then I'm happy. At three stacks here on my queue, I am going to spawn the grow. Actually, no, I'm gonna wait. Because if I get this melee, I get my level two and I get my first strike. And I can look to spawn four ghouls on his face if I let my E. I want him to go for the last hit. And I E him. There we go. And now I jump at him. And now I get first strike money. Oh, I thought I queued. I got 18 gold. So the mean I missed, I kind of spawned back. He is spamming Q on me. To proc his mana flow, but it doesn't make a lot of sense because he's playing D-Shoot. So three Qs and he's completely out of mana. Alright, I don't mind it. I get my first strike again here. Oh, his timing was amazing there. He shouldn't trade too much with me though. I have sustained, he does not. He doesn't have mana either. And like I said, I just want to focus on the high CS numbers. And try to make him miss last hits on the turret or something like that. We've only missed one CS this far, so it's good. I want to try and wait for my first strike and then land my E. So now I get first strike. And I miss. Okay, I got a lot of money there still. Like I said, focus on the last hits. This may let me give him my level 4. And then I'm going to W here, E him. Kite in there. Ooh. Like I said, enemy draw is passing into bolts. So I'm not that scared of a Viego gank here. In fact, I'm not scared at all. And I can play to my limits here. If I just EM right now, there's instantly a goo going to be spawning. I don't need to have three. Now I have two. I get my second biscuit at minute four. Remember that. Okay, there goes my first strike, but doesn't matter. If I land my E right now, there's three goo spawning on his face. Waiting for him to go for the last hit, then throwing it. He should probably be looking to reset. And I could match that. But if he stays, I'm very happy. I'm going to try and cancel his base. Oh, his shield is too big. I can't cancel, but I can cancel him with W. Nice. And now what I would want to do is slow push this wave, hard push next up and reset. Because the Viego is not going to gank me yet. And then I can get the slow push to reset. I get a tempo reset. Malvin is going to be stuck on the turret catching. And we're going to be very good. I get about level 5 here from the cannon. I could also biscuit. W him. E him. Lock him in the cage. He also hit level 5. Uh, actually, I don't think I should have done this. I think I should just prioritize on this wave. Because I could have used my goose to help me push this wave. And I would almost have it in. And then I would get a much better, t faster recall too. I think I made a mistake with what I did. But it's alright. I, th I should still get it in. Alright, I'm just gonna jump on him as well. And now we reset. Uh, I'm just short. Okay, yeah. This is what I was scared of by taking so long. He can't kill me. Okay. Like I said, I should have prioritized the wave and not the mob fight. 
And I got in trouble almost because of it. Because Viego, when he's done ganking both and resetting, he comes back to top side, right? So I'm a free gank for him. But living is actually very massive. Because two things happen now. First things first, I get a freeze. But second of all, I also slow down the Viego a lot, right? Because instead of farming his scams, he ran all the way top to try to gank me. I get level 6 here exactly from this wave, by the way. I'm trying to cancel his base. There we go. He's level 6 already. This wave is still frozen. And it absolutely sucks for Moffat if I cancel him again, because that means he loses an extra additional wave, but it's alright. We don't have to cancel him again. Where the wave's already in a perfect position. I gotta make sure I don't press my Q a second time here, because I would spawn the goose, my freeze would go away. So I'm gonna wait for this duration to end, and only then am I allowed to press Q. You see, now if I press Q, I would spawn the goose, there goes my freeze. I don't want to fight here, Moffat's TPing back with level 6. Moffat has already lost a full cannon wave, and he's losing a full additional wave here. We're super far ahead in... CS. So, I love my position. Now, one thing to consider here is that Malphite is priority. And there is a plant in the river because it spawns at minute 6. So, I don't want to look for too many trades here. Because Malphite would just be able to walk into the river and grab the plant. So, it's not worth it. Spawn that ghoul. That's alright. That was kind of lucky. Like I said, Malfa can always get access to the plant here, but what I can do is ult E him here. And now I get this ult out, for sure. Oh, that's a mistake, buddy. You're still locked with me. I healed too much because of the wife. Suck him! Suck him, baby! Suck him, baby! Oh, let, let me hit. You should have sucked. It's alright. If I land my E, he's dead. He can't get access to the river right now. Viego died, but he's probably coming back into topside after his respawn. Or he goes both side again, I'm not sure. If Moffat says I can look to dive him. If he goes for less, it's that's what I want to E. Get him, baby! Suck him! Suck him! Suck it! Okay, close, 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 close. E again. Suck him, baby! Suck him! Suck him! Suck him! Okay, get it, 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 get it. I'm gonna recall. I'm scared of Viego regaining me here. I'm gonna try Prophet Hydra. I'm never gonna be able to freeze waves anymore, but it's alright. I wanna try the Prophet Hydra rush. Actually, Eclipse is probably. Ah, whatever. Yeah, Alan, I know what you mean. <laughs> All right, we can freeze here because I'm tier. Oh, oh, thank you, man, for sucking that little piggy. Okay, yeah, it would be nice to freeze, but I wouldn't be able to freeze anyway because of the maiden. So it's all right. We're just gonna hard push, and we're getting a lead through first strike, CS, and that stuff. It's hard to last it. Alright. I need to land my E's for the first strike. And I have four goose to jump him. Bro, getting four goose to hit you and being stuck in a W? Bye bye half your HP, baby. Getting the maiden out of the third range. Getting the maiden in range now so everything spawns a little homie. Landing the E. Kedang! Landing the Q though. Alright, I'd like. Oh, yeah! Hey, minute, 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 minute! Okay. I got the plate. I'll be careful. 1200 for my item. As long as the maiden stays alive, I have perma control because look, every time a minion dies, it just spawns a little homie, like that. If I Q it as well, if I just kill it. Even if I don't kill it, by the way. If I, if I don't last it, it would still spot a homie. But if I land my E... I gotta kite them. I was just out of third range. Made it, made it, made it, made it, made it, made it, made it! Okay, he has to reset. That's alright. I can get the swipe, I can get the plate. And then I'll reset as well. I have a shutdown. Because I get so much first strike money. Bro, this wave clear is ridiculous. I'll stay for one additional plate. 
It doesn't change my recall, but I can get it, so why not? Video's coming, but he's probably going for grubs. I got a recall now. Okay. It does change my recall. I can buy a longsword. There we go. Next item is... Surreljas? I probably skipped the Eclipse now, right? I probably don't need Eclipse now. I got like full lethality set up now. Let's see. Uh, Viego is here. Kane is here. So I am weak set right now, but Mavi doesn't have ult, so I'm not necessarily in danger. I am. Okay, shut up. Uh, I lose one million worth of XP. That's all good. Nice. See about this one. All right. We only lose one melee. Uh, what I can do here. Since I'm weak sided, it's just maybe check here. Because I have four homies. Silas is moving too. I'm incredibly strong here. I'm just gonna take these. He's gonna take the Malphite though, that's why he's going top. I'm gonna have to eat this. Oh. Oh! Suck it, baby! Suck him! Suck him, suck him! He does not get ult, right? Oh! Where's my sucker? Oh, the Q healing! Please! Oh! Oh, the Q healing healed me for like 200. That's stupid. Calculate, calculate, actually. Cal calculate, actually. Calculate, calculate. My wife almost left me. Or I almost left my wife. I'm gonna EM once, so just be a bitch. I'm gonna be annoying here. TP, please. Okay. Then don't. Then I'll just get the turret. Please give me your luck! What do you mean luck? That was all skill, bro. Mad? Mad at my skill max combos? I got four homies with me. Yo, Tar! Okay, I'll sit on the Dirk. And then I'll go for this. I don't have any kills, but we are rich, 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 rich. Mid gap. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey! I want a passive income. It's okay though. It's okay though. It's okay though. We have 217. Diego dead. Everybody dead. Alright, GG. Please tell me these topside camps are up so I can get some passive income. Whee! This is my favorite moment of your gameplay, baby. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute, chat. Whee! Give me that shit too, baby. Give me that shit. Look at that. Look how fast it takes too. And now we're going to go for Her Herald. Because I still get the four homies here. Okay, one died. One, one deceased. Uh, first take, I first take uh, Scuttle. Alright, you guys do the scuttle, I take the pink, that's a good deal. And then once they're done with that, it's gonna spawn a new homie. And then we do the herald. And the beautiful part is, I don't get the damage reduction, because the maiden tanks it. Yep, so I actually one-shot the herald. I am the fastest champion in the game to take herald. And so chat, I just took Viego, Slopside, Jungle, Scuttle and Herald all within a minute. So, four jungle camps, side wave. That's all that. I love this champion so much, man. I don't know why I never played this champion earlier. I want to be here. Or do I? But I could. Tell me of the beyond. I never make it. My damage, bro. Uh oh.
Hello guys, I'm Aloys. Today we are gonna do a coaching in the top lane. Wait a second! Suck him, suck him, suck him, suck him! Suck him! Suck him, suck him, suck him, suck him, suck him! Oh shit, not me! Suck him! Suck him, Aiden! Get him! Close, 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 close. I think I made my maiden back up for the nanosecond by walking too far away. Well, we still killed him, and we get the turret. And, uh. Guess what, chat? We can take the Gromp again. Everything that stands must fall. Bomba. And, uh. Take this in the meantime, too. Look how much chest I have now, chat. It's crazy. I have one kill, by the way. I don't need more. I already have uh, 3k gold. I got the tier 2 turret. I got one kill. Nice. Yeah, I don't know. Hello, guys. I'm Aloys. More kills. Thank you for primer. Wait a minute. Does the maiden follow me if I go into Herald? Oh, wait a second, chat. chat. We gotta do some drifting to bot lane. I wanna go to bot lane. What? That's definitely what I clicked. Oh wait a second. Okay, whatever. Like whatever. That is some bullshit. Me bot, please. What do you mean, ping me away? Ich komme. Me bot? No. I... Disagree. Let me land my E on him. That would've killed him, unironically. Run, 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 run! Holy shit, Yasuo. Don't be too good, Yasuo. Well, I guess we just look for the tier 2. That's alright. Getting carried again! Suck my nuts. I have more gold than anybody else in this game, by the way, even though I only have one kill. There's 13 kills, Silas has less gold than I do. I can guarantee you that, by the way. By the way, by the way, by the way. This horde consumes all. Will she expect this? Maybe. Yes? My wife! Hey! Stop it! Stop it! No wait, I eat him again. She's gonna turn. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Why did I eat? I need to. I need to think. If I eat, my wife becomes a re idiot. I keep forgetting. You wanna move, baby? You wanna move, baby? Move that from that. <gasps> My cannon! Uh oh. Okay, let's run. I can do hair and Nasher soon. One more wave. I'm gonna queue here and reset. Well, I didn't get the fourth one. Oh well, I did the fourth one. I am company. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
Two, three, four, baby. Let me solo her. Ah, whatever. We don't have to solo it. We don't have to do cool things. I can do something cool here, though, chat. Wait, wait. I have an idea. I have an idea. Let me cook, okay? Let me cook here. Let me cook here. Listen, 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 listen. So what I do here is I'm going to ult right here. Spawn the homie. Right? So the homie is here. Wait, everybody recalls. That is not good. And then what I want to do is recast this bitch so she stays here. And now she won't follow me. She stays here. She keeps pushing. And I push bot lane as well. And we call this... Multitasking. Kill him! Kill him, wife! Wife! Kill him! Kill the mewer guy! Kill him! Thank you for the damage, that's... I'll take the damage, set. I wanna one-shot this Valkos with one E. Well, GG. Well, GG. Who's gonna have more gold chat? The 20 kill Silas or the 2 kill Yorick? That's a very interesting one. 20 kills, 2 kills. Okay, 19 kills, 19 kills, not 20, not 20. I shouldn't exaggerate. But let's see who has more gold, okay? Place your bets, what do you think? Type 1 in chat if you think Silas, type 2 in chat if you think Yorick. 1 in chat for Silas, 2 in chat for Yorick. Do it. 1 is Silas, 2 is Yorick. You all think me? I respect it, chat. I respect it. <laughs> it's 90 kills, though. It's 90 kills, though. Alright, let's check. Slightly 70 says down. Yeah, but that's like 4 kills, right? But we did get a shit ton of turrets. That's indeed true. Two kills against 90 kills. And Yorick has more gold, baby. Yes, sir. Two kills against 19. Hey, if that proves you, a f well, I would say one thing, but more things, learn how to do macro. Learn how to farm. Good. League of Legends is not centered around kills, okay? You can get gold by 50 million ways than getting kills. Natural resources, tier 1, tier 2, tier 3 turrets, jungle camps, side waves, all these things. Don't only play for kills. I have two kills. I got more gold than this guy. Keep that in mind. See it as an example. <whistles> Freak a del, bro. You fuck, bro. All right. This song is absolutely amazing, but we'll pause it and keep watching the Yorick rework stuff because it's still an amazing video. Bro, the old wrap up with such a creature, by the way. Didn't the 19 kill guy carry you? Question mark, smiley face. I don't know, you tell me. Bro, look at this starting item! Double fairy charm and potions. Imagine this was actually like once, this would actually be okay in the game. 
Like, imagine you come to lay your press tab, you see double fairy charm in your opponent's inventory. Like, now nah, this guy is a, like, you know, this guy needs to be jilled. I remember, I remember once playing Rumble Top, like, season 2, season 3 or something, and I had, like, 9 health potions walking into, like, or something like this. Legit, I think. Something like that. It's, like, something ridiculous. Anyways, all good. Give me last pick, because I need to go toilet. Thank you. That works. Right, I'm gonna turn the video. I'm gonna ban nothing and go to the toilet and keep the video on. So I'm right back. Okay, you guys can enjoy the nostalgia whilst I'm not gone. So I'm right back. I I roll the camera because I have to jump through the hole in the wall here. Yes, behind that curtain is a hole in the wall because my room is being remade. Okay, so I'm right back. I don't want to show you guys the wall. Be right back. Yo, Ziggity Joe, just just imagine they would in like implement a ability like that right now, by the way. That there would be a champion that is able to clone anybody and just do that. How outraged would the community be? True. Yeah, that's what I thought. That is genuinely one of the most broken things ever. Wait. Somebody said that Visit Chachi used to play this in LCS. Who said it? And why was nobody able to farm besides the Graves AD carry? <laughs> Ah, but nah, but nah, but nah. Wait. Oh. Look at the Cassiopeia. Look at the Cassiopeia. Dies. Responds. Instantly is able to cast everything. Just kills everybody. Bro, mana potions, health potions, this shit and the tier. Can it get more? And somehow he has 15% CDR as well. Dude, League of Legends used to be such a disgusting game, man. Like, absolutely disgusting. Bloodthirst or Yorick? Mr. Big Russ!
Dude, look at these character things too. Thresh is still actually the same. Tristana looks like fiddlesticks. Cassio looks like fine. Sejuani looks like a three-year-old version of the current Sejuani. The classic white steel build. Hey, fuck it, oh, yo, 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 you wanna say hi? Zeg even gedacht dan. Yo, what's up? What's up, G? Alright. I don't know how he got in here, I'm pretty sure I closed the door. But I guess I didn't. So now he's in here, and that is not good. Shed matchup again. <coughs> I'm gonna have to let him out though, because... There's no other way to get it. It's gonna terrorize me, so I'm bitter back. I'm, I removed my camera for a second. Bitter back. I give you guys good music, though. Ah, whatever. I'll just let him be. I'll let him be. No, I'll let him be. It's fine. Alright, this matchup, we played it already today. Pretty fine with this matchup. We just hard out skill, but let's not grief this time and let's not trade level 1 to level 3 that much, yeah? He wants to leave, but my old door doesn't work anymore. Alright chat, two things to focus on. We hard lose our matchup in the early game, pre-6. Also, they have a very strong early game jungler. So, two things to avoid. Early game trades. Why? Because if I take too many early game trades, they could die for me, level 3, level 4, level 5, right? So be careful of that. What are you doing? And, um... Uh, second thing I gotta be wary of is the... F Wait, did I close the door? Is he, like, stuck now? Uh, is that I let him get too many early game crashes. What well on sweet, like, donuts? Oh, that sucks here. I will try and get priority if I can, by the way, chat. Because Shen level 1 is still not that strong, unless he plays aggressive. Oh, they have halved. Oh, that sucks. Come on, GG. I was ready for this game. Okay, I need to let my cat out, so give me a second. Okay. I will turn this Yorick video on again. You guys enjoy it for a second. I'm gonna grab some water and let my cat out because he's being a pig. An absolute piggy. Okay, I'm rolling the camera for a second and I'll make it louder so you all have good audio. I better back, okay? One second. Okay, we back. 
GBA99. Who remembers GBA99? I remember that name. Okay. My criminal cat is gone. Water has been refilled. Life is good. So let's go. Yes, know who a good coach is. Sir Trekky, oh, favorite tier one, bro. That guy is good. Shen is so fun right now. I'm glad you played it on this account. Yeah, I mean, I want. Alois underscore NL. I appreciate it, bro. Thank you for I'm considering putting Shen again in the next poll. I actually played one Shen game. I had a lot of fun as well. Uh, the thing is, I want to play either Shen, Urgot, or Elawi probably in the next one. Shen, Urgot, or Elawi. So, yeah, let's go. Disgusting. Hardest champion in the top. Gangplank, Griffin, Aurelia, Fiora, these champs. Old Mordekaiser. Bro, Old Mordekaiser, that champion was so cool. Am I in queue, by the way? I'm an idiot. I'm so sorry, chat. Yeah, old Mordecai was stupid, bro. Nah, old Urgot was legit disgusting. I mean, I know what the New York does. We do. We all know what the New York do, does. Should we watch the old Mordekaiser? Old Mordekaiser. That champion was weird, bro. This champion was really weird. I played the old Mordekaiser. He was very fun. True. He had two reworks, actually. True. Before, he was not able to spawn dragons and stuff like that. That was after his first rework. Who is the noob? Poner tw Wait... Oh, never mind. I'm not reading his name. Um, I wanted to read the names, but I'm not reading that. But Poner12 says you. How is, this, how is this name ever allowed? Never mind, bro.
His E ability was so satisfying. And his last Q auto attack as well. That. Bro! Look at his flash animation! Look! Takes over your entire screen, bro! Oh, that E animation. This this was a broken item. This this green one that healed you, I believe. This green stupid item was a healing item. Yeah, like, so kind of like uh, Mordecai, or like Volibear passive. If you hit somebody, it would like spread, but like the main target also took more damage. Uh oh. Speaking of Volibear, the only game we lost on this account was against the Volibear. This champion is disgusting. By the way, can we talk about how Ghost used to look like? And why doesn't Ghost look like this anymore? Bro. How cool does this look? They should really reintroduce some old things, bro. Like, legit. <laughs> some things were just better in the past, I feel like. Could be wrong, but yeah. Alright, let's focus. We will keep watching this. It's interesting to, like, dive into uh, the... How do you call it? Nostalgia. All right, play against Grass Volibear. We need this music to beat the Volibear champion. Okay, chat. Volibear isn't that strong level 1. But from level 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, he becomes a pro. At least he's not playing with Ignite, so he gets less kill pressure onto me. But he does have TP, which also makes it harder to, for me to manage the waves. What's walking here on my wall? Weirdest bug. Get out. Is Yora currently strong? Yes. Did he have Q start? I believe I saw Q start there. It is to the grave. Why does he Q so fast? Last hit? Let's go! Wait, I gotta turn the music down a little bit, sorry. 417. Wait, what? Gold gained! 17! Gold in inventory! 16! Riot! Where is my money? Imagine how much money they've already scanned me actually now. IRS is everywhere. I'm gonna look for priority if I can. I get level 2 from this wave, by the way. I only need 6 minions. I don't see Volibear, so if I can look for priority, any losing matchup can become winning. Getting priority chat. I always say this, my famous line. Kill that guy in the face. Two, two casts here will get me level 2 because I got assist level 1. He might not anticipate for this. Get him, bros! So now we got early game presence, also because we had an extra longsword. Look at that chat. I played the, one of the worst early game champions against, against one of the strongest, but... Yeah, I got priority. Anything can happen. And I do have the extra longsword though, but even then. Now I gotta be careful though, but he lost his potion.
It is Quagmire, bro. Okay, I gotta be a little careful here. But I'm gonna hit level 4 faster than him. But I don't have mana and potions. He's still a way stronger beast than I am. Get my level 4 though. Oh, that had to land. I think it's best for me to just set my reset up. Volibear should try and hard push this, and he should hard push next wave, and I just base TP. And then I'm gonna be able to freeze it. And now my job would be to try and cancel his base here when he's going to try and reset. And I'm in a good position. You were going to say fundamentals, weren't you? Bro, if I want to say fundamentals, I'll say it. Trust me on that. Where is he? Okay. Canceling it would be massive, because then he loses his entire cannon wave, but I think... Okay, yeah, he, he's still pretty far away. He lost one melee, he definitely loses a second. Maybe loses the cannon worth of XP as well. Oh yeah, he lost a lot. My reset was still amazing. Sorry. Hit a baby! Hit a baby! Hit a babies! That's pretty shit. Oh, good. We scale. We scale. Chat, can I see some listening emojis in chat? This is my favorite song right now. This song is amazing. If you don't like it, you're wrong. This song is amazing. What an amazing song. There are my listeners. Turn it up. Let me get my level 6 here, chat. I lost 0 XP. Because I'm a little piggy. Alright. I'm going to hit level 6 here. We're through the hardest part of the game. Which is the early game. I mean, they're getting the grass to get the replay for it. We're scanning for free here, chat. Ooh. I could reset. But mama didn't raise no bitch. Bomba. Uh, bomba. Alright, let's reset. Do I want to reset? No, he's half HP, no TP, no potions. I wanna stay. Nice last hit, piggy. Wait, but... Did I get the gold from the plate? Did I get the gold from the plate, chat? Please, please tell me I did. Wave's pushing into me. I wait for him to go for the last hit. Wait for him to go for this last hit. Oh, he's gotta run. The wave's pushing into me though, I can just reset as well. Aha, uh -huh, tricked him. Watch them squirm. Nope! Nope! No- oh. Well, I guess I didn't get it. E? I tried to ult, but I didn't have it. I'm low mana. Suck him, baby! Suck him! Alright, slow push this wave. Hard push next, chat. Brent is bot, so we don't need to be scared of a jungler. We've got one biscuit here. I need to let this E. Yes! No! Why did you hold that way? I was dead!
Run, run, baby. Ah, I'm gonna die. 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 I'm gonna No, but second baby, second baby, second baby. Ah, but second, 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 second. No way he lives. No, there's like no way he lives. I'm oh, gonna have to carry this one, chat. We're gonna have to carry this one. Oh, it's hard to kill champions on my champion. We have perfects, yes, though. Alright, let's back off. Actually, probably take one more. I've got the PM50. Alright, let's recall now. Alright, let's go. I could go for this. I am going for this. I hope it's gonna be worth it. Okay, chat, let's turn on this song. This song one more time. This is this song. This song. The one we're gonna have to carry, so we need this song. I've carried worse. I've carried worse. I should have been there, 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 I should have been there. Where are the bros? They're taking the turrets, pigs! I my my homies didn't follow me, they were just taking the turret. They're like, you know what? Whatever. Where's a Morgana? My wife! You grieving bitch! Talon could come for me. Army! Army of minions! Get that pig! Ah! Okay, he's gonna jump here, he's gonna jump here, he's gonna jump here. No! I execute fam- That is not good! Okay, I've had some kill opportunities, we definitely missed some. It's okay, we scale. It's okay, we scale. There will be 
ATP. We're still pretty strong, chat. We're still pretty strong. Talon is going here. Volibear is here. And two people are here. And that gives me the opportunity to play for this. Yes! Get him! Talon's going bold, so I assume Brent is there too. Whoa! Take him down! Take him down, guys! Take him down! Take him down! Take him down! Take him down! It was him! Take him down! 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 Not the wife! 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 Okay. Okay, come. Give it to me, please. The dead have not forgotten. I don't have bros. Nah, but what is that? Wife, come. Wife, come. Wife! I should reset. I could reset. And I lose the wife. And I lose my wife. And I lose my wife. What are you doing? No, please let have... We win. Nice. I needed my wife. Talon mid, brand top. Only Volibear can be here. But Talon could be coming. Man, can this guy leave? I can't really progress with this guy. Like, I can't kill him. I don't know how to progress, shit. I can't like take it under his nose, you know? There's a Varus. We gotta kill him. I missed that E. Nah, we dead. That's why not good. I'm gonna have to kill people, but that's not what my champion does. Sonya's rush. The beyond is waiting. The Isles remember. Your turret has been destroyed. Ah, but ah, but I'm gonna keep pushing. I'm 
I didn't have to press no. I don't know if I could have killed the Brent somehow, man. I don't slow. Do I lose the Herald? No. Uh, the thing is, the Volibear is doing really well this game because he's never leaving the side lane, so I can never progress. I can never get the turrets. Yeah, exactly. Volibear is always just catching me. And I can't really get more gold income, and my team keeps dying. We're literally 19 and 2 behind. What the hell? Like, my team is actually doing nothing. Yeah, actually nothing. Are you gonna take my. Okay. I know what can save me. This song, this song, this song, this song, this song, this song, this song. This is not the song. This is not the song. This is not the. There it is. Okay, we're gonna win this game. I don't care. I wanna win. Don't, don't, don't. I wanna win. That's one kill, baby. That's one kill, baby. That's a turret, baby. Jump him! What is that jump? Are you stupid? Get him, baby! Okay! That's the E I had to land. Ah! That's the one E I had to land, man! And where are these pigs? We got some stuff, though. We got some stuff. I landed the EW on the Vardas. Uh, the brand legit solo killed me. You can hide your flash auto Q. Alright, that's good to know. This Volibear is playing really well given his position, by the way. Yes, I've done a Trondor Climb. I'd like to do a Trondor Climb again. I could. I can put him in the next pool. I'll put him in the next pool again. Ah. Hard game. We've done Gwen. Vayne top lane next game with Purple Van Link. I'm gonna keep pushing here. Create one pressure point on the map. But the Volibear is smart, he matches me still. Yeah, he's smart, he's smart, he's smart, he's smart, he's smart. I can progress into him. We're gonna recall and go here. Look, this guy's three items, by the way. I'm also almost three items. If Zack engages. I don't get the shutdowns. Okay. I have to stop this guy. This guy's level 16. How hard are we gapped? Dude, his W one shots my goose. 
What do you mean? Where are my goose even? I got the 1k. I finally got the shutdown myself. That's worth. I Look, I almost got the full level for killing him. I just hit level 14 there. Okay, what issue? <laughs> I don't have a single teammate, bro. That's a, that's a, that's a heart issue. <clears throat> and they're gonna have soul. Like, I haven't had this shit of a team in a long time. Like, it's actually hard to carry with Yorick because you don't kill people. Twitch got a 1k, Katarina got a 1k. Yeah, I don't know. Don't think we can this is dragon, really. No, then I just pushed up. Yeah, veel dingen zwaar je. Ik zou gewoon mijn kont kijken, bro. I'm gonna keep pushing top here, and I hope for the best. Their Baron is gone. They got to play. He built Magi's. He built a Magi's. Talon has a Magi's. Why did they ping me? Bro, play ball against Brand! Like, did, like, what can I do against that champion, actually? Now I'm mental. Uh, second loss. Hey, we had to take it. Dude, Volumer won again, but like this guy didn't deserve the win. I mean, he played fine. Yorick, we fucked this. Oh, you play your best, Yorick, we fuck. Oh, okay. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. An actual wholesome League of Legends player. Those are pretty rare. The song did not carry me. So shut up, song. He didn't carry me. Here, you get the tilt proof. Yeah, we are, no, we actually beat Volibear once. This Volibear did not deserve the win, though. <laughs> Holy moly, my team was useless. Dude, I was still almost equaling gold with this Talon. He had 13.16 gold. I had 12.4. Okay, chat, we're three hours in on the York account now. I'm gonna ask you guys, what do you want me to play? I'm gonna make a poll. Would you want me to play... Play main account? Oh, so where... So, sorry, where play? Where play? Play main account? Play Yorick account. All right, you guys can choose. I'll give you guys the... Oh, what's this highlight, Felix? I'll give you guys the opportunity to choose in between one minute. What is this? How did you find this? Bro, Felix, like, get... Really, Felix? You you searched a vault of 30 minutes to find where I missed my wall hop. That that is That is a crazy disrespect. Okay, York account is winning. That is crazy, bro. Alright, Trixel, you're getting 10 minutes for that. Nah, Trixel, nah. I won't take that. You're getting 10 minutes. You're gonna suck my fat nuts, bro. Nah. Who else? Who else? Who else with the estimation mark wall hop, huh? That's what I thought. Pieces. What would you like to play? I'm actually enjoying the York account, but I saw some people asking me regarding the main account, but it looks like uh the democracy is saying Yorick account? I'm having fun on the Yorick account, let's keep going. We play more Yorick once the challenge is over? Maybe. The thing is, the champion doesn't work very well in high elo, but it's an amazing champion to play in general, yes. Okay, Yorick account won. Favorite park back home? Dude, do I look like I go to parks? Do I look like I go to parks, man? The rank at the moment is Diamond 4, Diamond 3. I'm looking forward to seeing you play against a counter matchup. I played against some counter matchups today. I played against Gwen, played against Yorick. Played against Volibear rather, twice. Oh, Shen twice. Eh? Gwen, Yorick. Gwen and Volibear, my man. 
Change skin? No, I'm not gonna buy a new skin. Can we see the poll? Can we get a poll to see the wall hop instant? You can get a permanent if you want. New viewers who didn't know you played with Eka. Thoughts about him as a player? Eka has been one of my favorite teammates. Throughout my professional career, playing with Eka was definitely one of my favorite teammates. He's uh, really chill to be around with. I think he's very good. And um, he's very adaptive. I like him a lot. I don't really have too many negative things to say about Eka. Other than that he is legit. Like, that, that guy just lives on... Has like a shit diet, bro. That, that guy... Echoes be the type of team player that is like, you know, it's 1 p.m. He's like, you know, I'm eating pizza before scrim because I'm randomly hungry. Actually, no, that guy doesn't eat a full pizza. Ah, whatever. It's like gamer things. Gamer things. You didn't play versus Yona Rea, true? No, I have not played against Yona Rea really yet. Or Jax. There was one Jax game, but I got dodged. One time I was going to play against Jax, they got dodged. Unfortunately. <laughs> Unfortunately. Yeah, I still have problems to pick my main. I like yes one. I really like the same. Which one is better masters? Why do you want me to choose your main account? Both have their own benefits and their own downside. I would say in the general sense that I really is probably better when mastered because she has more scenarios where she's actually good. Uh, Esco, Dico, you can choose whatever you want. Maybe Trinimere. Something like that. Cyrus, can you please send the link here? Actually, no, I can open it here. Exhaust, piggy. Nice play, though. Don't like the song. It kind of went slow, though, Cyrus. Like, why did you need like a half a second every time to think where your next queue goes? That could have gone faster. But you're, I mean, nice timings. Nice timings on the W, nice timings on the exhaust. Take that bitch down. Riven players. Riven players, man. Thank you, Bangas. I appreciate it, brother. All right, let's go. This is the last official game I played, by the way, chat. This is the last official game I played, ever. He was not the banger. I was weak side of the whole game. He was not the banger. Alright. Rumble. That can be easy. In fact, that's probably going to be really hard. But... I am up for the challenge. We do outskill. Like, it's gonna be super hard early, but, like, after level, like, 9, I'm gonna get, like, Eclipse. This guy, if I land Eep, dead. Let's go. Yeah, I want some different music. Let me go for this one. Alright, they have a lot of champions that can dash on me. Sinzal, Tristana. Pretty hard. Pretty hard this draft, I think. A lot of things I have to be careful of. Uh, and playing against Tristana sideline cannot be easy. Alright, let's see. This is going to be a tricky game for sure. I'll use some eye drops. Yeah, give me one second. We're playing as Mammoth, man. Alright, chat. My goal in this game is going to be to scale to level 6 without falling behind, okay? That's literally it. Scale to level 6, don't fall behind. I'll teach you guys how to do that. We're playing against a super strong early game top lane champion with... Uh, Arcane Combat Flesh Ignite, so very scary, and they have arguably one of the strongest early game junglers. I'm very weak in the early game, my jungler isn't also that strong in the early game. So we lose 2v2, we lose 1v1, I'm gonna show you guys how to get to level 6, and I'm falling too far behind.
All right. Yo, three Raiko, welcome. Remember when York was OP in early landing game? Yes, we were watching a video about reward York earlier. It refreshed my memory. He used to skill really bad and be broken lane, but now it's again like a revert. By the way, again, look at one thing. Look how small my legs are, right? Like my legs are small compared to my body, to, to my torso. Look at that shit, bro. Literally, my legs are like the longest you've ever seen. It's bugged. Or maybe it's just a chiller. I don't know. I could consider e start this game. Let's see. He's trying to copy my buddy. Alright, I'm gonna try and get positioned in this bush so he can cheese me. I mean, he does kind of have a weird walking animation. His legs are like curved. Like, look at my legs. <laughs> okay, they're way longer. They're just curving. If I can get in the second bush, it's amazing. If he walks in here, I can auto Q and do like an okay trade. If he does an insta show, I'm probably going to. Oh, what was that? I mean, I could realistically hit it. Oh, he has E. He's allowing me to walk. Oh, he should go Q start. Because now I can actually hit the wave. Because I can just step behind the means and look for priority. Rumble with Q is actually very obnoxious to lane against level 1. He should never go E start. Look, now I can actually get priority. And that makes my matchup 10 times easier. I'm going to stack my Q instantly here. He has bone plating. Alright, we learned that. I get two extra means to help me push. I get my level 2 here first. I actually get presence in this lane now. Right? So any losing matchup can become winning if you get your level 2 first. If he pushes it back into me like he's done now, I'm happy with that. Because if he pushes it back like this, I'm not forced to walk up for license anymore. Like that. Perfect. But I was able to farm very freely in the first two waves here. Like I said, chat, our goal is to scale to level 6 without falling too far behind. We're doing amazing. We're in the happy spot now. We're not forced to walk up for last hits. I'm gonna hold it here. I don't want to use my Q because I want it for the cannon. If anybody flames my wall up, I'm perma banning you. That was about E. Love seeing some good old Meowric gameplay. Yo, thank you for the T1, brother. Appreciate it. He's gonna queue, so I'm gonna walk away. I, I I kind of acted like I was going for the last hit. But I'm a good actor. I have three stacks. I'm gonna E him. My Kha'Zix has passed into top. So now I want Rumble to queue the wave. Like, he's pushing the wave back into me again. What Rumble should do is make the wave push towards him, because then I'm forced to walk up for last hits. Okay, since I was top as well, Bojo has passed top. But by this, what the way the Rumble's playing, look, the way he's pushing into me again. Guess what? I'm not forced to walk up for last hits. Guess what? I can farm for free and scale for free. I'm not under any pressure. Yorick should... Or... Well... Now I'm getting a dive range. Okay, he's kind of letting everything. It's fine. I'll reset for double long sword. I'll reset double... Actually, I think he's moving for my Kha'Zix. Yeah, he is. That sucks, but nothing I can do. I missed my E. <laughs> Alright, he had Flesh and Ignite still. I didn't anticipate that. What Rumble should do is reset, by the way. He should not try to push this back. Okay, so this is making a mistake. I didn't expect him to be there already. That, that, that is a bad death. But by him pushing here, he made a big blunder. He should have instant reset. So now I can still play the game, because he pushed it back into me. I can try and cancel his base, can try and stop him here. But he's going to be close to level 6 than I am. I think I actually don't want to cancel him, because he's going to lose a full wave. For uh, okay, he's going to stay. Take shape. 
Did I kill him? Yeah, uh, reset timers. It's a diamond for player. Diamond for player. All he had to do was reset while he was pushing towards him. His lane was won. His lane was won. Reset timers, chat. They will forever remain the hardest one for people to master in general. Legit. The one fundamental people struggle the most with is reset timers. Had he just recalled and I instantly said it, his lane would be all like his lane would be one. I got four new ones that are gonna come with me to base. I can get double long sword refill and we're in a maze position now. Alright. Oh, I mislinked my cookie. That's unlucky. Well, we're kinda even. We get a level six. We have flesh advantage. We flashed here, so it's gonna be like 920, I'll say top. Alright. No, Brefa, he wouldn't lose much, yeah. He wouldn't lose much. Due to the position of the wave, where it was, like, located. Ooh. I'm gonna harpish this wave. I'm not gonna move. Harpish the wave first, then move. <laughs> what do you want me to do, bro? You're griefing. What is he? Wow, he walked like that. Unlucky. He put, took the plant in the river, that's why he's so healthy in the first place. Okay, sit his top side. Maiden? Should have walked away faster. I wanted to flash Q on the rumble, I hesitated too much. Oh well. See if I can kill him. Need twelve hundred for my reset. I'm building Eclipse first. I'm probably gonna utilize my TP to get my reset here, chat. So, um, well, two minutes of farmer. He has no flash, but I don't think we can do anything. My Kazakh is too low HP. We're just farming here. Alright. Just gonna eat him for the first strike. Spawn one ghoul. Was that a Sinzao? Or Tristana? Tristana. Oh no. We're fine. He's gonna get one shot. Yeah. Idiot. Did Rumble flash? No, he didn't, right? But I was kind of just hand feeding my. Uh... My jungle's kind of hand feeding this guy. A little bit frustrated. I'm 
You gotta be in grief, man. Ugh. What can do? I'm being grieved. <coughs> alright, it's alright. It happens. It happens. Uh, this next wave is gonna walk into my turret as well. It's so bad. I lose so ridiculous amount here. I'm gonna sell this for an extra longsword. I need as much damage as I can now. This Rumble has four stupid kills. I think my John has died to him three times. Yo, bro, looks like I'm alright. You're doing amazing yourself. I lost two full waves here. Did you see that Slogan made a YouTube video reviewing your gameplay? I didn't see the YouTube video. We're gonna do a coaching session together. I didn't see this. Yeah, I made a YouTube video. That's alright, though. Yeah, this guy's level 10 now. I really got grieved. I don't know. Yoda could be moving, or Rumble could be moving, rather. I don't know where the Rumble's at. Is he doing grabs? Oh, he recalled. That's an ult. <sighs> kind of frustrated with how far behind I am, although I didn't really make mistakes. Oh, come on. Nice. Nice. The AW was good. I got new golems here. I can maybe get the food turret. They have six grubs, but I think I can get the food turret here. Bro, everybody's hard losing. Ah. Run! Run, baby! Run, baby! Oh! Oh! Wonderful. Okay. Well, we're scaling. We're scaling. We can do it one more time. He's dead again. And then I get the food turret. Okay, that's massive. Okay, finally. We got a good spot. I'm not too scared of this Sinzao. I'm gonna play for the turret. It's actually the first turret. I have flesh. Nice. Nursin. You can get the Herald. I'll just start the Herald probably. Now we're fighting. I got three homies. Two. Really good. 
Still got three homies, so I can do the Herald. Now we just gotta outscale, chat. Now we just gotta outscale. Second item in base two. Is Rommel trying to freeze? That was still bounce. Oh. What? I guess we're on the ward. Oh. Kazakhs took it. Uh, I guess we're on the ward. I'm gonna get Red Trinket. We got two items now. Weird enough, before, like, we were super far behind, but we got the full turret, we got 300, we got one shutdown on the rumble, so we are stronger now, we are for sure stronger. He has flesh, I have flesh, I think I can outplay, that's a massive. As you gotta not die. I don't need to queue them, my goose would just spawn because of the maiden. If I land E on Rumble, he almost dies, I think. But I gotta land E. Oh, he's mid. I'm gonna keep pushing, bro. He's mid still. Just stun, I could come top from base, I suppose. That sucks. Yeah. Alright, made it time to run. If just had a moves mid, I get a T2 to it. Oh, yeah. I can sustain from this. That's Tristana TP, they have no other TPs. I stay sideline. I wanna get to your two here. Why are these three just running? Oh, that sucks. I get the tier two though. And I could maybe even TP bot. There's a wave here too, chat. If I get both your two turrets, it's so massive. I'm gonna try. Oh, I don't have the TP. Mm. It's seconds for my TP. <laughs> That's a wild kill. Voice. Okay. That's massive. We're in the game. I have my third item even now. This Rumble still only has one item. This guy had one item complete before I even was close to my first. So we have really got them back in this game well. I shall perform your right. Wait, I finally understand what he means with I shall perform your rights, of course, because it's a great it's a, it's a funeral. I get it now. Give me this. Oh <gasps> no! Oh, cringe double flash. But they both die for that, right? Not if my Kazix is a pig. What an average game here. I think I want blue chicken again. No, we couldn't win the Volume game. Nice. What was those sounds then? I mean, look, I'm three and a half items in. I am super strong, truthfully. Two items. Just gotta have two items. No flesh, no flesh. Uh, six grubs. 
Ma ah! I'm gonna try Solo Nash here, probably. I should've kept Red Trinket because of that. Completely forgot. We can do this. They have no flashes. They don't know how fast I do this. They have no idea how fast I'm doing this, bro. Easy. I'm almost dead. I can do a trick here, chat. I might want to leave the wife here and go bot without the wife. Or do we bring the wife? What do we think? I kind of want to set her to top. Right, wife, you go top. Not mid, not mid, not mid. Top! I place my wallop, I'm perma banning you. What? Show me the trick, Alois. Revenge of the Evil 10. I, I legit walked top, recasting and this bitch was like. Bot. Bitch. If anybody flames my wallop, I'm perma banning you. Was almost in trouble with the cops, but thanks to you, I was the first who found the meth boss. No, 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 Joe Crazy. Remove the name Joke from your name. That's not okay, by the way. That was not okay. Jump, bros. There's a Sinzao behind him, I know it. Alright, Joe Crazy. Thank you for the tier one, but that was bad, bro. That was bad, bad. I'm gonna keep pushing, by the way. I don't move to team fights. I'm too fancy for that. Well, I don't have to, I guess. Bomba. Well, randomly we're oh, randomly we're in the game. Maybe that was a reason why the wife went bot lane. Maybe I should listen to the wife more. He's stuck. I miss my ease. Time to run, baby. Oh wait, the, the wife's not gonna follow me. Wait, he's killing him! The wife almost killed him. That's crazy. Alright, let's TP. Oh, I got assist! <laughs> Thank you, wife. Can I get some salutes for the wife? GG to the wife. She dead, though. Dude, I only have 4 kills, I get I 4 items. I, I just love the amount of gold income you get on this champion too. Especially with the first strike, you're so light on items. You never buy boots, you don't have to spend money on that. Just go kind of fast. 2 items above the... Uh, rumble. Alright, give me some passive income here, bros. Help me take this stuff down. Smolder is 7 and 2. And he's dead. Look at that. That was 1 E, by the way, chat. That's 3 quarters of his HP. 7 and 2. I'm scared. I'm scared. Eh. Probably should just walk to it instantly, but I'm a pig. In game, I don't know. 100 buffs. Let's go for the... Felix? We talked about this, Felix. We talked about this one, Felix. They were in biz, though. But we did talk about this one. A little longer, friend, than rest. Somehow my W encaged to Tristana. WIFE! She lives. Somehow made it out. Only two? Yes. Mm. 
No! No! Oh. That's just gonna kill me. Worth. Worth. And cringe. And cringe, yeah. I need this item. Then I would've won. Then I would've won. Your wife went better than Lois, and that's 100% your teammates. What are you even saying, bro? Alright, different music, different, different, different music. Advanced audio properties, Google Chrome, I'll put it to like 8. So I can put it a little bit softer for myself. And then we go to... What's this one? We don't go to that one. We'll go here. Yeah, let's go. All right, let's go. Chat, natural is a 25. You know what business has to be done. All right, we're going to do some business. We're going to do some business here together. A bomba. A bomba. All right, chat. Oh, take this fast for me, bros. Faster, faster, faster. Thank you very much. All right, now for the real challenge. How fast can we do Nash? It was 56. Like 57. Uh oh, shit. Stop! Stop hitting! Stop hitting! No, I'm losing! I'm losing! That's it, good! Now what? We're gonna flip it. No! But like. I should have thought about that. We learn. We live and we learn. We learn. We learn something new today. Don't do Baron because you can't de aggro. Hello, Mr. Fundamental Sky. Greetings from a Greek guy living in the Netherlands. Yo, bro. Welcome. Movement is goaded. I agree. Wind Trader, winky face. No, I don't think a soul to masters is a thing. I'm gonna wait a base for this bad boy. We're doing all right, Shuriken. Thank you. All right, let's push. For food, no, I mean we can get one more item. I'm gonna wait for the team to be on the map. Wait, why did that spawn? Oh, cause I eat the camp. I see. Is Edge of Night. Mammoth man. I did thirteen hundred damage to that guy too with my goose. My goose, baby. <laughs> Alright, anybody else? I was like, wait, why do they have Baron? And then I remembered why. Uh, wife? Thank you. Since I was respawning. Where's my wife? Oh, there she is. 
I need to land an E, man. Chat, they're coming for me! The wife is dead. Bomba. Alright! We beat the Rumble Pig. We beat Mammoth Man. They got hand fed by my jungler. Not an easy game, but we take it. Let's go. Ugh. This should have been so much fun, chat. Unironically. I know a lot of people hate playing against it, but I think it's really fun to play. Like, really, really fun to play. Top Boated W! Thank you for the primer. Nice W. Thank you, bro. Alright, let's watch the old Mordekaiser chat. We're watching the old Mordekaiser. Alright. Felix, what highlight do you have? Do I actually want to see this highlight? Yeah, playing against this, the war it always feels like no matter how hard you are, he can still kill you after he gets two items. Yeah, he's very strong. Was like an easy game, but look at that piggy player. Yeah, I used to play such a... Dude, I had to play Sejirani in, in pro play. What can I do about it, bro? Oh, what am I gonna do? Alois, what are you doing, man? Alter, you do best time. It... Dude, I'm gonna say one thing here, though. I'm gonna say one thing here, though. It's kind of impressive that I somehow managed to ult here, no? Yeah. Can we talk about the fact that we're 4k gold down here? Can we talk about that fact, by the way? Don't give me PTSD. Don't give me PTSD. Felix, one more of those, see what happens, okay? X Smithy, bro, come on. That said, you already forgot what team he was on. All right. Uh-huh. 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 Oh. That's all right, Jed. I don't understand. It's okay. I don't really care. This item was broken, by the way. This book, I remember this item. It was Quora Mordekaiser. Don't remember what it did, though. Children of the Grave. Dude, this is old Simon, by the way, in case you're wondering, right? Just just in case you're wondering, you're like, who is this creature over here? That's Sion, guys. That is Sion. Did you stall the thing he threw? He stunned Mordekaiser. Holy moly. Oh man, all these memories. Nice swap with Raptor, nice motherfucking fish. Zigs into fizz, GG well played. <laughs> What's this guy saying? Can I sup? We're duo. Go. Krug, can you pick later? I wanna first pick. So we ask for first pick, pick Ziggs, motherfucking fish, Zigs into fizz. <laughs> Bro, some players, man, they're just weirdos. Yo, Hammer Kim! How you doing, boss man? I'm doing amazing. I hope you're doing good yourself, bro.
rank or around time three or more now with the Yorick account. I like this draft kind of, kind of. I just like that I have a Zek jungle and a Soraka ult from yourself. That's all I like. That's, I guess, uh, the way it goes. Nar. What's this? Open a GG. Okay, Hammer Kim Smurf Korea Noob Elo. Korea Noob Server. Hammer Kim Faker. This kid, yeah, is crazy though. Good job, Hammer Kim. King. Why buy Tabbies? Are you going electrocute? The lack of precision. Banger. This is the best Jays probably in the world. Met him in Korea. We're playing main today? Well, we made a poll. Chat wants to see Yorick, so I'm gonna do Yorick. Come here, Korea. I I come Korea probably in June. June I go Korea. <coughs> All right, for the Emerald again. How are you telling me Emerald? We won last game even. I think I have a support main on jungle, by the way. That's always scary. That's always scary. All right. Uh, let's focus. Let's go out. Oh! Easy grave to dig. I got flesh. I don't have ego. I flesh. Oops. It's your fault, Chad. You distracted me. Oh, yeah. Music is loud. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, bum bum. There. Uh, let's focus. How quick the turn from blessed to curse. I mean, I'm gonna try and match the priority because he's not hitting the wave. So if I can get priority, even though this is not a, you know, a good matchup for me, I'm able to hit the wave. So I'm going to utilize that fact because if I get my level two first chat, that means that he's going to have to focus on last hitting, and I'm gonna be able to focus to farm for free, like I'm doing, right? Very nice. All right. Amazing. Wait, these two don't spawn? That kind of sucks. I need to use this graves. Very nice early game. Perfect CS still as well. I just gotta be careful of an early mass gag now. I don't have flash. He should have been dead. Unlucky, I don't have flash. This E lands, he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. Oh, he has E again? Very nice. 
There's my STE. I don't have flash. I'm probably dead. I'm gonna click here as high as I can. Okay, I'm gonna recall. I lost the cannon. <sighs> Sucks. But we have to recall, else they can dive me. Massey is really good at diving. I'm still super happy with my early game, but it just sucks that I can't do much. We're still super far ahead in CS. I'm gonna try and cancel Snarf's base. No, it actually doesn't make a difference. He's not gonna lose anything from me canceling him. Do I one-shot this? Unlucky. Still very good farm. Okay, well, I lived on weak side, enemy bot lane did not live on weak side. I'm doing my job well, we're ahead on weak side without flash. And again, my bot lane gets two kills. And their lane should win, Blitzcrank Kalista, so this is absolutely amazing. He has no potions. Dude, I'm landing all my E's, man. I'm landing them all! <coughs> I'm not gonna help. No point in helping my job do grubs. What?! He was doing the golems and stuff. Wait, Massey just randomly saw the jungle camp. Massey's like... Why did Massey just go to the jungle camps though? This game. This Massey still hadn't recalled, he was still topside, he was doing golems. Z uh, no RSTP, right, so I should recall. I should recall. Bro, this thing is le legit pushing the wave though. This thing needs to die. Nice. Why is Zach even complaining, bro? I'm getting full weak sided, like shut up. Uh, victim, he's a victim. Does he know that I was weak sided? I was ganked into spam ganked? All good though. What I had on weak side chat, we're doing our job. And our bold side is running our strong side because enemy team did not respect weak side. I think he eat, right, for the turret? Yeah. <laughs> ah, he was eating for the plates. I was like, wait a second, didn't he eat? Yeah, he did chat. So I land my o E, then I spawn my ult, I spawn two extra ghouls, they jump him. Yeah. Hey, I'm weak set this whole game, bro. And I lost flesh level one. Look at me. Well, the cannon is being in focus, so all my goose will stay alive. Massive. I am not missing ease this game. I am not missing! I killed my wife though. And I missed the plate. Oops. Scream if you need R, I don't look map. That's what I like to hear from my support, I guess. Alright, I'll just yell. I lost the plate to my wife there. Not the war not the not the best rather. 
All good though. What an amazing spot. I never understand why it shows Mega when he's clearly not Mega. Right. <laughs> Oops. Don't smite it, bro. What are you doing? What are you doing? Holy moly, am I fast there? You don't have to take that. Zach was like, oh, oh, the wave too. Ah, bitch. You took my kill already with the double buff. It's enough. That's the EI miss, really. But what is enemy team even doing? Like, they're just, they're just running. Like, what are they actually doing? Might as well just take a turn, bro. He eat again. If that landed, he's dead. He is dead. Fade away, baby. I don't know. That guy's headed. Wait, I can spawn? Oh. Hello guys, I'm Aloy. Today we are gonna do a coaching. Yo, Kratos, even a 51 months in a row. Yorick, where he summons little piggies. Dude, if somebody makes it, legit, somebody said this already. If somebody makes it, I, I'm taking that skin, bro. If somebody makes it, I, I, I'm, I'm using it. I'll use it. Alright, wait, let's just end this game. This guy's had enough. They once called these isles undying. Yet die they will. Give me that shit, baby. They're fighting here, I'm gonna go for the tier 2 and then I'm gonna go bolt. That damage is so stupid. To be, wait, to be fair, I'm also a lot of levels up though. Yeah, how did I miss? Oh, I just aggroed them. I need some homies though. These are not enough homies. Can these spawn? No. One home is not enough to give me passive income. I was gonna go bot. Game over though. Absolute game over. Like 
I'll test some limits. Oh yeah, no TP, never mind. Well, this is what happens, chat, if you respect weak side top, and enemy bot lane does not respect weak side. They go int, we go smurf. Can two ghouls grab the dragon? Surely not, right? That's not enough to write the two of them. If these two kill it, York is the most broken champion in the game. There's just no way, right? It's two of them. No, oh, that's not enough. It did the half of it though. The two ghouls do 4k damage with dragon. I see nothing wrong. Suck a baby! Suck a baby! Suck a baby! Sorry. Suck kill. One in three E hit, easy kill. I always hit my E. Look at this. Told you. You made me, Felix! Hang it on your bits, Felix. Imagine your neighbor hears me shouting that. I mean, what about my family? Yeah, well, it's alright. I think they've grown used to it. Alright. Oh. When we end, we begin again. We end it. <laughs> GG, close ones. Smash mark. Oh, thanks, Leafy. Yo, look, chat. We've got loot drop. Look. Bomba. My homie hooked me up. My brother hooked me up. GG. My man. Hey, we're out of bits. You know, I would be interested in Sejuani on the to master. See if you found the method so you quit pro play and still suck it. I'm the best Sejuani in the world, by the way. But it's okay. I'll give him a. Uh, Tilt proof. Can I play Kesante next game, please? No. S plus, baby. Can we do a cooking stream with bro? My kitchen is way too small to do a cooking stream. Way too small. Not doable. Maybe one day. All right, I'm going to eat some food. We watched the old Mordecai, so I'll be right back.
Yo, bro, I just have a dragon pet. I just have a dragon pet. Oh, uh, York. Oops. I hope it's Uder Top because I feel like Yorick shits on Uder Top. But let's see. Bro, he even brought me napkins. <clears throat> Alright, we're like diamond four, diamond three. Four. Two to two has already knocked me out, actually. Alright. Uh, let me switch the scene here. This one. Alright, nice. Those tortillas were exactly what I needed. Oh, I feel much better now.
Yeah, I was a little spicy, a little spicy. All right, chat, let's talk about this game. Um, first thing to notice, both junglers are kind of farming junglers, right? Uh, Udyr ganks are pretty scary, but my W just kind of counters them completely, so... If I have my W, I can always escape one of them. Warwick is extremely, extremely strong in the early game, so... Man, okay, I need to chill a bit with talking, because my food is still there. We gotta be a little bit wary of... Uh, basically, two things, okay? We gotta avoid trading with the Warwick because he out-sustains us, but he also out-DPSs us. He wins short trades, he wins extended fights because he has better sustain. So he wins short trades. And he wins extended fights because he has more damage to the tempo. So, basically, I shouldn't trade at all. And what that means is that we're just gonna play with waves, okay? I'm just gonna play to have high CS numbers. I'm gonna play to set up good reset timers and be able to skill to level 6 and beyond. <coughs> no trading. No fighting. No fighting. Okay, the enemy bullet did not leash. I might E here. Look at the means. I pity what you've become. Shall I, oh, I did that before. I only got one. I'm a pig. It is what it is. I would have been too late. If I can hit him and the mean, that's amazing. Oh, baby, two of them. We're avoiding trades. My jungle is gonna go into both sides, so. Remember my name. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I can't go for that one, I'd lose too much HP. I'm gonna let my ward on now. What's one more grave? Again, avoiding trades at all costs. Get hit. Okay, decent. He's only missed once, yes. I missed way more than that, but... Do you hear that? Okay. Yeah. I have a ward here to see if he wants to recall. He hit me, so it doesn't hitting the means anymore. Okay, I'm gonna communicate that he can, this guy can start moving. I don't have to cue him. Okay, I should have set my cue for that, I guess. Now we're gonna play at the bounce shot. Which can prove to be tricky against the Warwick champion. So like I said, the only focus is mainly going to be on the wave. But if he walks up to me like that. Now that's a good trade. It is to the grave. Second grave. There's one biscuit here for mana. I'm gonna hit level 5 here. Two graves. I'm gonna spawn them. I just wanted to push the wave for me. I don't wanna hit the work with the E. I just want this wave in. I'm very scared for Udi to also gank me. Okay, now it's gone. So now I can E him. Oh, wait. I can't help you, bro. I have mana for my W. I'm gonna recall now. He has no TP, he's gonna be stuck in lane. Alright. He cannot push this wave out entirely. It's gonna start bouncing into me. I hope he tries to push. He's gonna be level 6 here, though. I think I'll sit on a Dirk. 
No, I'll sit on pickaxe. And just accept that. I mean, maybe I should have stayed for my longsword. I definitely should stay for my longsword. I'm a greedy pig. I get gold from the grubs. I should have waited for that. Each grub gives me 10 gold. He's gonna hit level 6 right there. <coughs> I need my level 6 as well. I'm gonna wait with spawning the maiden. Now we spawn it. I'm gonna block his path here. Okay, that's fine. He UA sold. There's a plant nervous spawning. He still needs to set up his reset. I can always look for the reset. Oh, for the plant, rather. I'm gonna keep my stacks here. That's hard to hit. I'm gonna look for the plant the river. Okay, it's deep. I'm not gonna go for the full plants. Ooh, there could be here. We haven't seen either of their map for a long time. He has no mana. What? I mean, I think this is just Warwick brain. Warwick player brain. He had barrier. He had flash. But he has no brain cells. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, no recent timers for him. He ran out of mana by queuing me. Couldn't E. I'm gonna stay. I'm not gonna stay, rather. Um, spawn these. Recall. I get four homies with me on my recall. I might lose the plate, but ultimately it doesn't change my recall because I can get longsword call fits anyways. And uh, yeah, we're just looking to skill. I'll wait for longsword now. How does Yorick work? That's a very vague question. Okay, well, we're scaling amazingly well. We got solo kill to Warwick with 150 gold here. We lose the plate, but we only... 400 gold for our item, right? And Warwick has spent 1.2k gold to his item. So if you take Blade of Truth King, right? He's going Bork. He needs... Total gold. It's like 2.8. He needs like 1.6, right? But again, I only need 400 gold and I have my item. So keep it in mind. Oh, shit. I'll try to put my first strike before it hits me. That's good. He does have ult and barrier and flash. And no brain cells. Um... I'm gonna harpish this wave and instantly reset chat. Again, I'm not gonna stay for the plate for multiple reasons. First reason is because I'm item in base. Second reason is if I insta recall. Oh wait, I shouldn't have done that. Okay, nice. Stay with me. Three three recall with me. I'm probably gonna lose this plate again. Oh wait, I didn't want to do that. Uh, I get my eclipse and now by insta recall, like sadly I cancelled it, so I lose like five seconds. I'm able to play out the bounce. Try to stop on the bounce again. Yeah, I, I can't buy anything, so I'll just get a pink. And I'll get blue ward, why not? <sighs> For some reason, I, I am 2-0 with first strike money, but I don't have a shutdown. So, collectively, my team is very far behind. 30 CS here, 30 C or 20 CS here. Both like even. But we're super far ahead on top. We got a full spike. We're going to keep scaling. All right, I can EM instantly. I still have three homies. I don't think we should fight Grubs because... They are way better in the river than we are. We're gonna get my pick worth here. I saw Udir mid. He has, he has gotten his reset in, so we gotta be pretty scared of the Udir because he did reset. Look at that damage. Made it, made it, made it. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, good. When Warwick hits a certain threshold, he doesn't actually heal anymore that much from his auto attacks, right? The waters, the Don't chase, Maiden. Stay here. Uh, 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 uh. I Sadly, I can't take these homies with me. Used E. I don't think we should fight here. He is on items. The hacker hasn't reset yet. 
It's obvious we lose. I can't bring my small guys here. I lose my wife now. So the thing is, the reason why I didn't want to fight is because I constantly checked who there's items. Alright, I want to see his reasoning. I checked his items. He didn't even have all these items. You can be as emotional or pick as much as you want, but it's not on me, buddy. You're all mistake. You're all incompetence. Finally got masses playing Vayne. Are you guys proud? Vayne King won. Mods? Any mods? I'm just taking my first strike. 45 is quite hefty. That's, a, that's pretty good income. He's running out of mana again. I'm gonna queue here just to spawn them. And hard push. If Oracle wants to reset, I'm gonna make it tricky for him. Their Uther is extremely strong, so that's a person we have to keep respecting. I got four homies. He stayed. My things are gonna hit him, so I can turn aggro. I gotta be careful for that. Every time he uses mana, it becomes easier for me to play. Again, I can just use my W for the Uder gank, right? So I just gotta make sure I keep my W up and we're fine. First strike timed. Plus 45. Oh shit! Again, 45. What the hell? He's no mana. Uder is bot doing second dragon. I'm just gonna look for more plates. I can't really look to kill him, fortunately. We can't look to keep pressuring and getting first strike money. I got four homes now. Oh, that's what I got. This is a lot of healing. 58 there, though, Jen. I got 45, 45, 58. I'm just getting kills by not killing him. That's nice. I think I ult here, and... Oh, I'm out of mana, though. Uh, he doesn't have enough mana to kill me. Thank you, Maiden. Uh, that's really good, though, because that gives us a chance to get back in this game. Because if we want to carry this game, we need this work to make more mistakes like that. I got a solo carry this game. My entire team is losing, so this is massive. I don't know, every time I kill Warwick, I'm just like, did I play well or is he just misplaying? Yeah, okay, that is the deer. We kill him here, though. A very nice timer by Twitch. Oh, never mind, we don't kill him. I don't have enough mana. Alright, I'm gonna get a bot now, I'm gonna tip a bot. This guy is a Bork. Actually, I'm probably, probably shooting a bot. I'm gonna try it. If I can get the shot down, then I can also get the turret. How about double pink on accident? Nice. Okay, so I can stop. It's a massive shutdown. Uh, I can get one more pick with the oh. I'm gonna back to full HP. I can also stay from oh for the turret a little bit here. Okay, Uther's on Herald. Massive. I'm getting sucked by the wife. I could have played that way better. I could have played that way better. Oh, uh, man. It's hard to move in nine games on the champion. 
they're like full 1v9 games. You kind of need your teammates to play somewhat like humans. Oh, it's painful! Well played. I don't need the second one. Let me top. Ugh. Twitch died to the Udir. Or to the to the Warwick rather. Against bot lane is so losing the game. By running it down in two versus two. I won't even type, but like so deluded man. Udir is twenty times this jungler. Well, enemy team is gonna play for a dragon, I assume. So I'm gonna play for the top tier two if I can. I don't wanna group. I know you should have played that better there. <laughs> Alright, Felix, tell me what could I have done better? Tell me. I know. Ooh, there's recalling. I think it's a full extra item almost. They could look to shut me down first before they play for dragon. Okay, Uther's bolt. Noise. This is my chance to try and kill the work and get the tier 2 chat. I can't kill that guy. Oh! Nice. I'm gonna get a dragon. Stalls them to get their win condition for five minutes. I need these homies to come with me. Please, please, please. Okay, I got two. It's decent. Why are you face checking that? Okay. Massive. We get our third item in base, but we have tempo on the map because Warwick is dead. Kalista and Oriana are here, so only Uder can come for me. He's full AP. I'm not scared of him. We have the maiden. Yo, oh, Osiris Royal. They were two. Yo, Raka, good to see you, bro. Yes, I'm Dutch. Alright, I can maybe get this tier 2 turret, or at least close to it. I, I can watch it with the E. Nope, okay, let's back off. Goodbye, wife. Serve me well. A minute 20, I can always consider trying to do the Nash solo. I got TP there. Well, that was well played. Perfect reset. I'm gonna move bot, get tempo on bot wave. Then once I have the mid, I can do solo dash at 20. I don't think work is used some yet. I've seen him use barrier once. Yeah, it's not the smartest though. My Twitch had just shut down. I think I just take this. Passive income. Rico go top. I don't think I can progress here. <laughs> or I was like, what the hell is going on there? And uh, just uh, actually. Uh, oh. Your 
Udra, can you mid? Soraka mid? I got 69 gold there. She has two items now. Okay, I'm gonna recall. I need to pee and do this. One shot it. We can one shot it. We one shot this. Brent should hit it too with his passive. Well, that's lucky. Get him, Goose! I'm doing Nash, I'm not stopping. Uh. Ah! Uh, okay. I'm gonna go stop for the tier 2. Let's go! It worked! I don't know, Udyr also completely ran it walking down without flash. But hey, that's good. First strike income, 1k already. Holy moly. But that's also because I'm playing as Warwick, right? I can never kill him. But I keep using it as my free first strike too. Wait, 1k is so much for 22 minutes actually. Alright, I got this item soon. The dead don't hear you, no matter how you cry. Because I end someone top with the wave, I could probably get this. I can spawn new homies here in a second. He's stuck in a cage. Oh, mama. I've seen better flashes before, and if you type, you get banned. I'm sorry. MB. I flashed me. No, I won't explain what happened. I, I will explain what I did. I will explain what I did. I will explain what I did. Listen, I flashed before the Warwick ult, and then I casted it once during, and then I was like, okay, I'm not casting, and apparently I casted it. It's my bad. Honest mistake. Honest mistake. Espacial work wall up? Alright, they no. 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 Kanipan, Kanipan, where are you? Kanipan? No. Uh uh. Why is your F on CD? Hey, can somebody ba mute Matt as well and ask him why he can't speak? That'd be funny, right? That'd be pretty funny. That'd be a pretty good one. Nice in smiley face. Alright, I still need to carry this game. And uh, that that was not good. To the cause. <coughs> I need to play for the bot tier 2. Last item here. This work is one item, man. Uh, please go for next wave, piggy. I should wait with my old, maybe. I should E into old. That's oh, alright. I can one-shot piggies. Dead. Close. Five and one mage, by the way. 240 CS. Against Jorik. Five and one mage, just like that. Get out of my screen, little bitch. Wife! Run! Wife, run! Wife, run! Wife! No wife. Mainless yet again. The reason I want Aloys to say is because he's small. Are you a primer? 
When are you doing a other roles like mid, for example, to masters? I'm down to do that pretty soon, actually. I could do a poll between any carry mid and jungle and see what people would want to see me play to masters. I got 148 first strike gold there. I'm dead though. I'm so dead. Wait, they're not going for me. Maybe I should have played stayed for outplay. I don't know. It's so hard to kill people with the chat, me man. It's so stupid hard to kill people. Like, I break it to low HP, but I can't actually kill them. I kind of wasted my Nash. Well, we are full build. We get our flashback. Uh. Last item I probably go Yumus. Get him, Goose. Good try. I still have mid tier one, man. That's a lot of damage. That guy just sprinted it. I can do Nash. That is a lot of flesh to I watch shot this thingy. And why did we die? Now we need to stop the soul. Wait, Brent is killing that guy. Brand legit. <laughs> I'd be a little careful. Yeah, I got three homies. I can go for Yumu's last. Ah, oh, let's re-go. I'll temporarily buy boots. We have 500 AD chat. We are strong as sh What I could do is let the maiden go top. I'm gonna ult here again, recast it. Maiden goes top, stays top. And now we're gonna go bot. Oh, that guy's dead. Maiden is gonna push top for us. Why is he full HP? I know it kind of runs me the wrong way. Does she one shot? Holy moly! Give me that, baby. Look at top lane. Pushing. Uh I should be bot. But look at top. Oh, 
I predicted it! No! You too, bitch! Get him too, babies! Suck it! Suck it, little bitch! Yes! Hey, get him! Like game Yorick, baby. Like game Yorick, baby. Trapped away with the maiden. And the game just like that. No biggie. Finally get some kills. Just need to be ultra, ultra, ultra late game to finally one shot people. Just do full nine. That feels good. It feels so good to have that control where you can like all top, go to a different lane and like still have that pressure. It, it's so weird. It's so disgusting as well. That's so disgusting. Feels good. Feels good. Feel, 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 admittedly. Admittedly. Feels pretty good. Oh wait, why did I honor that guy? That guy is like the, the last person that deserves an honor. I gotta give him the double honor treatment. That guy did not deserve an honor, by the way. Uh, he did not deserve an honor. As well. <coughs> Still no damage and it's hard to carry and kill with that champ. No, but like, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, the thing is, it is it is hard to kill champions now. Like, I barely got kills for like super long time. Holy moly. How much first right gold did I have? <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. I don't know, this champion is a monster late game, yeah? I could have bought one extra Lutherity item too there. Like, I could have gotten Yumus last. But I had 500 AD. Four four little piggies with me and the maiden. So then it's like, yeah, then it goes fast. All right, let's watch this. What do we watch? Is there a sign ups? There has to be a sign ups. I haven't been streaming this weekend, so there should be a sign ups. Yes, sir. All right. Just get slow dog to coach you. I will. We will do a slow dog coaching this week. Oh, that goes instant. I'll up the sound a little bit. I need to go to toilet again. Yeah, well, we'll get coached by Slug Dog. We will. This combo is so stupid, man. Hey, I know that guy! I remember this. Right, what's Zuko gonna do? Bro, I hate that it becomes unstoppable when it's E like that, but Zuckle is so good at using it too. Ah, never mind, it's just Zuckle the gap, never mind. I won't say anything, that guy's just too good. But the thing is, Yon's Q3, ult, and E are able to make him invulnerable, but you gotta make it like... Well, not necessarily invulnerable like his E2 is, but you can like buffer CC. But if you're just good at using it, it becomes so obnoxious. But it, it is very skilled, right? It is still full skill. It's like parrying in Dark Souls. Buff Yon. Yeah, that sucks. <laughs> Where's his first pick, Yorick? Let's see what happens.
What are you saying? Yo, yo, Mr. Bobby Bear, good to see you, brother. Thank you so much. Appreciate it, boss. That's at the lawyer's now. That's the guy that said minus one to that. That's a good. What? What do you mean? Wait, I didn't see. Yikes. That's a fast Darius. <laughs> this guy's angry. Two sets fight top player, let's go. Is that is that cool? That's not Kubon, right? No, no. <laughs> He's not happy with that. It's an interesting build here. Very interesting build. Oh, we play against Rondo. Or Vayne. No, it's Rondo. Nicht gut. Uh, let's go. Rondo's a tricky matchup, but nothing we can deal with. What playlist do we go for? Sorry, that might be loud actually. I'll reset this playlist one more time. It's good songs. Alright, chat. Um, so, multiple things to be wary of here. We play against the, the strongest of one champion in the game. Trundle with Ghost Little Tempo. So, he completely decides how I play the early game. My goal would be to try and still secure the at least the EXP of the first three melee means. If I get the EXP, I'm happy. I'm bound to lose the last hits, and what I want to happen is the wave pushes into me. So, two things I gotta avoid. First of all, I don't want to lose too much HP in the early game. Second thing, I need to not get all in. But that's kind of the kind of same as the first one. And I want to try to get the EXP whilst doing so. And I need the wave to push into me, so I guess that's the third goal. Don't die! Also, yeah, volume goes down. Sorry, it's because I had it loud for the signups. So, yes. No, you don't need Demolish on Yorick. This, these two pages together are amazing. Alright, let's go. We go Dimblade nonetheless. Uh, it's not like Ort to go anything else. And so I gotta be a little bit inventive here. Because if Trundle sits here in the early game, he can just uh, stop me from walking up to the wave. 06, 04. I'm probably not gonna end up going to Brazil. I'm not sure yet, but I'm probably just gonna go to... Korea, not to go to Brazil anymore, but not 100% sure yet. Oh wait, we're invading. That's good. They have no flash and no flash here. He's playing Ghost, right? Shouldn't walk like this, because he can just see it coming. <laughs> I'm gonna ask... Can you ward? I'm gonna ask for a ward. Kind of right, he doesn't want to ward. This ward kind of does nothing for me. So, what I'll do is I'll sit as a living ward in this bush. And if Trundle face checks, I'm gonna ward here. So, okay. Never mind, I'm too late. And this is exactly what the Trundle should be doing. He should be zoning me from approaching the way. But the thing is, I can't ward here because he can auto queue auto it. So, now I'm gonna be a vendor. I'm gonna try to sit in this bush and see if I can get to the XP that way. But it's a little bit greedy, right? Because he's gonna try and zone me from here. So, I wanna walk like this and get. Oh, he's here. Is he is he ghosting or is he trying to like invade or what is he doing? I 
Well, I'm in XP range. It hurts to remember. Nice. Wave's gonna push it to me. I got two. He got two. And again, I need to know. Okay, he's hitting the wave. It's gonna push it to me. All goals achieved. I got the XP. I even got some last hits. And the wave is pushing it to me. That means I'm not gonna be forced to walk up for last hits. That means oh, that this light is just gonna go very chill. All right. Don't want to trade ever. And uh, yeah. I get my level two here. The dead have not I got one ghoul. I could just E him for the first strike and to spawn one ghoul, make it a little bit annoying for him. I lose two free last hits. That's a bummer. Okay. That was my first strike as well. I... That sucks. Try probably E the caster at him if I can. Like that. Okay. I have to Q this one. I want to hold this minions with my health so it stays in what we refer to as the happy piece spot. I cannot help him. I cannot help him. I simply can't move. I don't get priority. Uh, I could have com maybe communicated this to Nilly that she should not path top because I don't get priority. But she should also know for herself that Trondo gets priority into Yorick. Alright, so now I gotta play out the bounce. I think that Trondo lost a little bit of XP which means he's not gonna hit level 4 here actually. Whereas I am, from two casters. I've got four graves here, so I can just spawn four homies, but I can also just keep the wave frozen. Wherever it may be. I gotta make sure I don't press Q accidentally again, because then I spawn four bros, right? I'm not sure what this guy's doing. Very nice. Alright, spawn the bros. We're level four to level three. And we got all the homies helping. He doesn't know where to hit. Level up timers, baby. <laughs> I won 100 to 0 him. Because I was standing. There was like four homies that he could have hit. That was my character and the W. So he was just full, full, full stuck. That's a crazy kill, bro. 100 to 0 at, uh, at Trundle. That is crazy. What are you laughing for, baby? Same thing. Did you not learn your lesson? What are you laughing for? I got flush by the way. Yeah. He's dead. Oh, he's not dead. He's gonna hit level 4 here. Which is something I definitely gotta respect. Oh. Yeah, what, I, what can I do? You also have to pee behind me. Oh, I didn't help! No! <laughs> I didn't even know it worked like that, bro. <coughs> Chicken out of the cage. Ah, oh, shut up. Bad joke. Bad joke. Bad joke. Chicken out of the cage, though. I'm gonna TP here. I wanna contest him on the bounce. Ah, oh, crazy game. Oh, baby. This chef is so much fun, man. And I get a freeze now. I'm gonna buy six. Game over, baby. Some would say... First for waves. The dead don't hear you, no matter how you cry. All right, I'm gonna cancel this guy's base one more time. He's already losing the full cannon wave now, Remember. and the more I delay him, the more he's going to lose. All right, he walked all the way back, so that's very good by him. But he still loses the full cannon wave here. Now that's um, that's already a shit ton because a cannon wave is worth 200 gold, and then he also loses the XP, right? So it's almost like Dying. You know, it's like losing a solo kill. You're losing a full cannon wave. And he's also gonna lose the next wave. And he's gonna come back level 5 to be being level 6. And I'm already gonna have Grave stacked up. And... He can have have. Sorry. Alright, let's set up this wave because this wave is getting too big. If I don't start thinning out now, it, it will become too big while he's back. So, it's gotta start thinning out because else I can't hold this wave before next wave, right? So, I'm just gonna start thinning out. Actively, I gotta always avoid pressing Q twice because then I spawn all the graves, but I can hit my E. Look at this poor guy. He's getting he's getting a uh, 420 damage done. That's one grave. It's two graves. I can E. Q him. I can always ult to spawn two ghouls. I see the card that's here in the corner of my eye. That sucks.
He hit level 6. It's not too scary. Wave was perpetually pushing into me, right? So I wasn't really in danger of anything. Bro, I just bit on like a pepper. Why was there a pepper in my mouth in the first place? Yikes. I almost have no water either. Full GG. Alright, let's spawn the homies. I just push this wave, set up my own reset. Alright, they did the grubs. Level 8. My thing is I gotta take turret aggro, so yeah. If he knew that he could have pillared me, I was actually dead, but he doesn't know. Alright, now we can recall here, because Chondo should not have enough time to collect this and hard push next to him before I'm back. That means I'm gonna get a freeze again, that means he hates his life, and I don't. GG. Let's run. I don't have to be full mana, because I want to be back before Chondo gets the time to hard push his wave to reset the wave. Now I can get a freeze again, and we say... I'm <sighs> it! Alright, I got the wave, you know. It might be in time, but that's all right. I'm super close to my item here, actually. 220 gold, and we have it. No, we actually still do get a freeze. No, I have to reply to the email. I would do it after the stream. Thank you for reminder, though. I had already forgotten. Remind me at the end of the stream, you're a goat. Five gold there. I am probably going to set up my next reset with TP, but and that's because I'm going to hold the wave here, but I can also just push it out and go for my Eclipse. I'll see what happens. He bought Tabis, man, and only 600 gold towards his first item. He is so far down. No first strike, no bitches. Oh shit. Okay, that was pretty pretty massive by him. I'm gonna hold now to get my reset in. He ulted me. Run wife! Don't let him slap you. Sir, wait, the, the, the wall like uh, kind of shot me forward. Oh, that's amazing. He should have TP though, so I'm actually gonna hit this. My stuff will deal with the wave now. If I hit the cannon, does it start hitting? Okay, time to run. Wife, run, 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 run wife, wife, stop being stubborn. Wait. The wife is alive. He doesn't know the wife is alive or what. <laughs> Watch the fadeaway. <sighs> Bro, the wife was alive with 1 HP. Saved my ass completely. Does he get level 8 chat? I don't want to risk it. The game is over already for him. Did he recall? Oh baby, he did not recall. He's in trouble. All the homies are swarming him! All these greys behind spawn too! I wasn't even counting on that! But basically the first three jumped in, 
And then the new home, like the graves from the from behind also spawned in and swarmed him. That is so, I don't know, that's a disgusting kill, man. He just got swarmed. Nice. Look at the food turret as well. Well, I gotta be careful here, he can actually run me down. I'm starting to get better with my ease consistently too. Ninety seventy five. Can I get this? I like it, bro. Wait, wait a second, 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 wait a second. That's like, <gasps> Woo! Just enough, baby. That's enough for me. I got a proc first strike as well. The G. Nice. I'm probably gonna keep playing top lane because he is Phage, this, I have two full items. <laughs> yeah, GG. Yeah, these E's are landing lately. These E's are landing lately. Makes the game a little bit easier to play. Never mind, my E's are still shit. Harold is in 20 chat. York is the best champion at taking that. Maybe I should have suppressed ult actually, so I can spawn three goose instantly. These are gonna disappear. But let's first take care of these jungle camps. Uh, yeah, so you kind of suck. He doesn't even have. He doesn't even have old. My bad. My bad. Yeah, so well, team gap, GG. I mean, game is absolutely over. Everybody's winning, did you? Yeah, yeah, better team as always. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know I have to spawn one ghoul, because I kill this, and then jump it here, and then this will spawn. Hey! Yorick Mechanics, baby! I'm starting to learn, sorry. That was like the only way to spawn at least one ghoul. Good job, boss. Yeah, I'm playable. I can always TP bot.
vorbei. Oh. Can I miss more? Okay, I just got fat outplayed. And I missed everything. Okay, that's not good. I got twice in a row without really doing much. P Mamba, unlucky, bro. Alright, I want to do the music. Let's go here. Chill music. I need to go to toilet and grab some water again, chat. Yeah. Alright. Uh, I think I just published up, but let's not play for kills and let's play smart. Yeah. Sounds good. Sounds like a plan. I'm gonna keep my TP. Actually, I wanna go bot. The reason I wanna go bot, chat, is because I wanna play opposite to the neutral objective, which is going to be better, of course. I probably don't want to ult, and I can do Baron. Who's here? Why is he going in? I'm gonna do something devious here, chat. I don't know why she's recalling. Idiot. Uh, just doing uh, Yorick things. Okay, make up your mind, buddy. You without glasses is some Clark Kent shit. <laughs> Alright, bro. Cringe! Should have considered that they could go top first though. But why are they even considering in the first place then? When they're top? Uh, it's full grief. My W was good, but she had flash. No side of my head doesn't hurt when wearing glasses. They are adjusted very nicely. I'm grieving a little bit, chat. I think I was 4-0. They are kind of targeting me too, but it's like obvious targets to... I don't know. It's alright. The problem is I can... Actually, I can get this wave here. I kill... Get three marks, then E here. 
So I can kill this normal... I can kill this with Q. This normal one I'll just get. I shouldn't have Q'd maybe. And I'm gonna spawn them. And I gotta do the Grom for me. Passive and goodbye. Ah, this game I had a good team. So the game is easy. I mean, I was winning my lane super hard, right? But my team is also playing in insanely well. Yeah, I can keep some graves here at the back. Three people here. Only Cartus Trondo could be here. If anybody flames my wall, I'm perma banning you. One year together, nice. GG. Thank you, Sparky. Thought of making the series. Never lose the matchup comeback. Hope you have a lovely day, Bossman. Yes, I wanted to do. Uh, I wanted to do a matchup guide, but I'm thinking of making it a course. But I gotta see how that how that will fi figure out. Thank you so much, Sparky, for the 12 months, but I thank you for the tier one. Oh, into old, but. They're already dead. Wow, that guy's fast. Okay, I killed him. I'll recon go bot. Yes, and I'll send for Netherlands. We're not winning. We're not winning this game yet. I gotta to go toilet, man. I want to end this game. I do not know what but you guys know how it goes. If you want to end the game fast, it's gonna take longer. So I might as well just take it patient. I'm not gonna do rep buff, because if I take it right now, nobody gets it. So Samira can probably do it. Two minutes so we can get Nash and Soul, so we should be fine. Yeah, and that also stands for never lose, never lucky. Um, I don't know what else. I do have item in base. Give me first strike, babies. Close. I should keep pressuring. Alright. Nice legs. No life. Nice leak. Nice looking as well. No ladies too. Okay. I'm actually gonna buy boots. Let's go. Bro, I am s I need to pee so badly. I drank too much water. We need to end this game. I can't hold anymore. Alright, I'm like a Heimerdinger now. <laughs> it almost worked! I think he TP'd on my wife.
Ah, the Inip is respawning. You're kidding me with that shit. Well, this game is not over yet, by any means. This van keeps flushing on me too, the piggy. Uh, Yasuo is doing uh, some montages. Got an E into ult. Does she get one shot? Not bad. Shouldn't have eaten him. Oh, there goes the wife. I must dig. Your team has destroyed the turret. Your team has destroyed the turret. Your team has destroyed the turret. All right, GG. What a weird game. Open Nexus. Ay, ay, ay. We need 3.3k gold. Oh, I need to be so badly, man! Yeah, so keeps going for montages. Didn't get that grave. Bottle is the way. <laughs> Shut up, pigs. There's two wards here, but they're going away in 40 seconds. Not enough. All right, the homies are gonna. Sp Push here. And I respond. <gasps> this guy's getting me some money. It's like the fourth time, by the way. And it was like 30 seconds before the dragon even. Like, it wasn't even almost the dragon. I, I gotta go toilet. I really have to go toilet. What am I doing here? Oh, but we're actually gonna like lose the game now that there was a ward there.
I'm bit up back. I'm bit up back, chat. I gotta run. How did we even lose? How did my team die? Nah, I have to see this. Nah, how did we die? What? How? Like, this Yasuo needs to be permabanned. That Yasuo legit. I didn't see what happened. Okay, my death here was bad, but this Yasuo for sure had a stroke, right? Like, look at Yasuo the whole game. He randomly decides here, it's a good idea to 1v1 Trundle. He died two times before this already, by the way. So he just died. Look at what he does when he respawns. Dragon is one minute now, right? One minute for Dragon. One minute for Dragon. Okay, so me dying here is bad. 100% my bad. And then I went to toilet. So how do we randomly lose the game? We get soul. Perfect. How do we all die? I was like, alright, I'm going to the toilet quickly. <laughs> and then they ended before I was even back. Well, sucks. Sucks. That's crazy. That's quite crazy. That is quite crazy. Alright, I'm being right back. I need to grab some water too. It's okay. All right, we're good now, chat. <sighs> Went for the second plate. Bro, I still have my first plate. I still have one web left. I can't eat it. I don't really have appetite.
I feel like I've seen this penta already. Did we go to a new video? I don't know. Oh. That's a blower. You guys know who a good coach is? Alois. Jorik means zero, zero, 001. Hey Alois, super excited for this climb. What are your thoughts on Jorik so far? And have it. you tried the slog dog build? I have not, but I'll get coached by him this week. Thank you for the primer, bro. Thank you for eight months. I don't know what the what the slug dog built also is. I've been playing Kerberos built. It's been working great for me. So, uh, yeah. Oh, Japan server. I heard it instantly. Oh shit, uh, Trundle Rennington. That's not gonna be easy. But we just scale again. Against Rennington. Wait, last time we were 1 and 4 and we just ended randomly. That's just a NA Challenger moment, I guess. <clears throat> Ain't no way. Ain't no way. All right. Let's go. We don't really win. Level 1, or pre-6, or after 6, or 2v2. It's just gonna be scaling. We just need to scale this game. Oh.
Sure, I'm gonna take some vitamins whilst I can. Some vitamin D and vitamin C for the man. <laughs> no, just I just good habits, I guess. Good vitamins. Yo, blood thing to the tier one. How's the day going? The day's been pretty good. Thank you for asking. Even better with you here. Both thank you for the tier one. All right, we're gonna be walking with my minion wave here. I'm gonna select Q. Yo, no splitting. All right, and just wait here. Okay, I don't see him. Could be leashing. Okay, he was in a bush. He's kind of allowing me to farm. If I can get level 2 first, I'll take it. Hello guys, I'm Aloys. Today we are gonna do a coaching in the top lane. Yo, thank you for the primer, brother. I appreciate it. I missed. I crunched it. Okay, I should stop trading now, though. I've already lost too many last hits. That sucks. I lost one. I lost three. It's all right. I got first strike ready, but one more melee after this one, he gets level three. So one more from that melee, he gets us level three. So I'm gonna be back in off chat. I don't want to trade. My iron is going into both sides, right? We are full weak sided. We're playing a bad matchup here. We're getting pushed in. All we do is sit back and farm. That's how you play most of your games, Jorik. I'll be warning here, lad. Late, sorry. So I can see if he wants to recall or not. He's level 3, so I gotta be extremely careful. Don't disrespect him. And then all the bounds, I can create some homies. And then I can play the bounds with the homies extra. Oh, it's gonna be awkward to last it, I think. Maybe? Yeah. I'm losing that one anyways. So I'm gonna hit this minion. I hit my level 4 here. Damn, that was a lot of damage. Now I gotta stack some more graves. He lost his potion. Almost got the other main too. Very good damage here though. The wave is still pushing into me because he's barely pushed back into me, which is a mistake a lot of people around this MMR do. I buffered my Q. Wave is still pushing to me. He has no E right now. Oh, that hits. I might have killed him though. Oh, he lost cannon. <laughs> Sorry. Alright, I guess flash is good. I was like, wait, how's our trundle? We're laying against ranked and not trundle. The wave's frozen here. They once called these isles undying, yet dying. I want to wait for him to go for one of these last hits and then E him. Like that. And I can freeze the wave with it. And ward here to see what he wants to do. He doesn't win that. He doesn't win that. Oh, no, 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 no. I did biscuit before the fight, so I get extra mana into E onto Q. Boom! Boom! Let's go. If I win this matchup pre six, it's gonna get really, really nice for me, bros. I can tell you that much. I am gonna go do this. I could have gotten the glowing mode, actually. Never mind. Should have gone for the mode. I keep forgetting. He bought tabbies. That's okay. He ult. He has no dashes, and I missed the easiest W ever. That would have killed him instantly. He was dead. He had not. Man, how do I miss that W? Movement speed. Tabby's move. I, I, I have nothing left. I now got excuses left, chat. 
He was dead, man. He used both. He's so disrespectful. Uh, I just got me, actually. I don't deserve to live. I really don't deserve it. Five subs to just flash onto him. I can't. I can't, I can't. Too late. I would have done it. No shame. They were out of it though. The dead have not... uh, that was a free kill. It's okay. It's not okay. I'm tilted, but it's okay. I appreciate less VI time, but I'm fine. I just missed. By the way, I hit my E. I missed my W. I hit my E even. The Isles remember. Alright, time to smart cast it. Yeah, I already had no ult, you little bitch. I win the extended fight there. I'm scared he's gonna get his ult soon. Oh, almost predicted this movement. I must dig. Trundle's not nearby. I shall perform your right. Huh? He's gonna all in me with his ult now. I'm meant to be, baby. The ruins of these isles rise to smite you. Oh, I'm so bad at this game. I'm just short of my item now, too. I waste my ult. That is just tilting. That is just tilting. I don't know. Just that I had like two windows to kill him for free. I missed both and then I played. Holy shit. Well, a lot of misplays there. It's okay. Let's reset. Stop playing for kills. Start playing smart again. I played too much for kills. After, ever since I missed my W, I've been playing for kill mentality. And now the mistakes have kind of stacked up. I'm gonna mute all and just focus on a good gameplay again. I gotta hard push this wave and reset. Hard push this wave, reset. You have a new task. Alright. Uh, they're mid jungle or kind of woman hiding. It is to the grave we go. They have all neutrals. I can't push this wave. Castrando could look to gank me.
Gotta make the way push into me. I couldn't proc the Eclipse. Well, at least my other lanes get the lot, huh? I don't know. I misplayed a lot. It's alright though. Rankton actually doesn't get anything. All the gold is on the Trundle, not the Rankton. I know one very nice thing I can do here is just get some passive income, baby. Yeah, just do the Grom for me quickly. Yeah, go there as well, piggy. Alright, we're getting some income. Rankton doesn't really get... Alright, I'm tilted. Why did the group even reset? But what? Why? Why is she here? What the fuck is this Ori doing, man? Who is this guy? What is her issue with me? Why does she randomly come from here when her midwave is literally pushed in? It's like the third old she's used top. Are you kidding me with this gameplay? I don't know, kind of a playable game for me. <laughs> hey chat, you don't have nothing better to type. If you're just pure negative, like Cryoson. Fuck off. Go somewhere else. Whatever. Fourth out of our top. Unplayable, man. Absolutely unplayable. Oh, we got mid tier one because she's never mid. Nah, it's just crazy. This guy didn't even recall. He'd just be waiting top somewhere. Oh, well. Everything is used on me. My team has actually gotten to play the game. I don't think this ranked in King Carry. This bolt with a bounce, which is good. Uh, I would like to be top. I can always just TP the bolt. That's good. In 30 seconds, I can TP the bolt. I'll still 1v1 this ranked in at some point in this game. So I'm fine. 
They used everything on me. This bot wave is pushing into me. Okay, Twitch is bot or not. I want a TP there, but I won't agree with my team. I would grieve this at sword if I TP there, so I'm not gonna do it. I am gonna pick this up though. Alright, we get Maiden soon. This guy isn't that strong. I'm still ahead in the XP. That's crazy. Walking for the living. For the dead. What's one more grave? All right. I'll play Tari. Hey, Z's already back. I'm just dead. He's gonna flash after me. Okay, that's lucky. Well, it's pretty lucky. Got a bit. I did not want to be on him. Wait, it's ult again? I didn't expect to have to ult again. Shit. Oh, I'm griefing. I lose nothing, but he gets a solo kill, of course, with XP. So now he's gonna... Yeah, he's hit level 13 or 2. Ah! I was finally getting some XP on him again, because I'm also getting camps in proxy, right? But I didn't expect him to have ult already. I bet. Ah. It's true, the CD got buffed. Holy moly. Hey, Chad. <laughs> um, top gap. That Twitch just popped off real hard. I don't know. That's crazy. That is kind of crazy. That is kind of crazy. Well, we've done the most important fundamental thing. Get the better team as per usual. Why did I just go there? Oh, shit. I have to not do much this game, I'll just win.
But he's kind of getting beat up, bro. He lost more than half his HP. But he still beats me, probably. Uh Oh, they're doing the one thing they know how to do best, which is abuse me this game. <laughs> I should know it's coming. <sighs> oh, I just got carried this game. I'll take it. You just drag me over the finish line team. I'm a pick this game. They are going to keep pushing though. Yeah, all enemy team has done this game is getting top, honestly. Already has used four ults in top lane, I think. But it worked, but not for the bot lane. I, must dig. I could have avoided some deaths, though. I also misplayed super hard. But we've been live for six hours. I ranked in the mid for once. I can finally get a turret chat. Finally, some dopamine. Walk once more. Finally. All things decay. They are coming for me again. Yeah, they are. That guy's level 12, by the way. I had to. I had to, chat. I had to, okay? I'm sorry. I had to. I really needed it. I told you I will still work on this guy this game. So, I'm happy, okay? That's all the dopamine I needed, though. Now we're happy. I need to let that out. I'm sorry. If you know, you know. Yeah, Ari, please come as well. See what happens. Come, Ari. I want to introduce you to Ed, Ed and Eddie. Ed, Ed and Eddie! Ed, Ed and Eddie! Wait, where's Eddie? Where's Ed? There he is, bitch! Mm. Alright, now I can go to bed with a smile. Dude, that was satisfying. I don't notice. Oh, mamma mia. Now I'll be. Where did that guy come from? Alright, ready to come. You can walk on me, bro. There it is. I missed that E. Of my champion, I think. Ari as well? Come on, Ari, I know you want some. Ari, you want this beef, come on. Get him, boys! Get that bitch! Wait. Yes! No! Yes! No! Yes! 
<laughs> Too much terrain for that guy to deal with. Uh. All right, chat. I took revenge on all of them. I feel happy. I can go to sleep with a smile. Get him, homies! Yes, sir. I think Daisy has a crush on you. We got Daisy and the Maiden. And the plus 50. I'm happy we won. I'm happy we won. What's that damage? It's Yorick. That's Yorick. Oh. What a stream. Oh. Adi can have it. Adi, smart at Tifa and Dragon Sword, he gets it. Who had more gold though? Hey chat, guess what? Guess what? At the end, at the end of all that stuff, I almost had the highest gold in this game. Zed just outshined me with 100 gold, but I have more gold than the 13 and 0 Twitch. So you can say I got carried, right? You can say I got carried, but look at how useful my champion still was. After all that stuff that happened, I was still 4k gold at the right at the end there. And I have most damage. Best support to main? I don't know, like Bart, set up for the US? Alright chat, after 6 hours of the groveling, grueling groveling session with that, my energy has uh, dwindled a little bit. I noticed that uh, my my energy turned a little bit toxic. I cursed a little bit, so sorry for my cursing. I got a little bit annoyed. So, um, yes, half. I have to send an email to the dude. I will. Thank you for the reminder. Thank you all, chat, for coming by today, spending your Sunday afternoon, morning, evening with me. I am extremely thankful and happy for that. Um, I had an absolute blast playing the shovel guy for six hours, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Learned something new. And enjoy the day. Th yes, thank you for the rights to email the guy. I will. Uh, chat, if you haven't, check out both YouTube channels. Check out the tier list. Check out my site if you are interested in coaching and or courses. Um, that's pretty much it. Let's raid Mr. Zenarius. And I wish you all an absolutely amazing evening. The remainder of your day. I'll be back tomorrow with more Yorick gameplay. Thank you all, chat, for your support, and I will see you all tomorrow. See ya, bros. See you tomorrow. Give me some love to scenarios.